There they are. Oh, I'll be taking these. <laughs> you stupid piece of shit! <laughs> oh, this is fucking crazy! Oh, 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 fucking crazy! Oh. <laughs> you stupid piece of shit! We now return to As the Chair Turns. Why won't you ever rotate your chair, Samantha? All I ever asked of you is that you rotate your chair. I don't like rotating my chair. If you want this marriage to work, you'll rotate your chair, goddammit. Just use the right thumbstick to, and rotate your chair, Samantha. Well, you never mess with objects by looking at them and pressing the interaction button. Like the things on the on the ground or the things on the desk, Reginald. Why, why, why won't you look at the things on your desk or the ground with the mess by them and pressing the interaction button, hmm? Just forget it, Samantha. We don't have time for this right now. The big staring contest is tonight. We need to practice if we expect to win. Yes, you're right. For once, Reginald. Yes, okay. Staring contest. No one talks. First person to blink loses. Starting right now. Are we starting? Do you just... Okay. One, two, three, two, one. Starting now. You have four messages. Message one. <sighs> Jeff, call me back. End of message. Message two. Your lawyer here. Not looking good, I'm afraid. Because the dogs are yours and because they seem to be powering this monster, you may be liable. Call me. End of message. Message three. Hey, asswipe! Your rent is due! This isn't a charity! End of message. Message four. Hey, it's Mom. I never did like those dogs of yours. I'm not surprised, to be honest. I mean, now they're powering that big old beak monster. Sweetie, it's a big mess. Anyways, call me back. End of message. Hey, hey, open up! Come out here! Get out here! Get, open up! Oh yeah, this is definitely the right place. You're the one. Okay, listen to me. We don't have time to get into it right now, but you're coming with me. We interrupt this program for an important breaking news. A giant big monster, you heard that right. A motherfucking giant big monster has destroyed the science center, damn near half the city, stolen science equipment, microscopes, beakers, I'm talking about flames. Things are really crazy right now. Shit's all fucked up, and this goddamn big monster has dogs that are plucked into his eyes, and they are powering him up above any power level I have ever seen. And he's scared people, my grandmother's afraid. All right, back to your regular schedule program. Man, you really, you, you're dogs. You have no idea how fucked things are because of your two stupid dogs. Ugh. This is a power baby. You're gonna be seeing a lot of these throughout the whole game. I mean, I really love them. I got them in my eyeballs, you know? In my eye holes, I mean. So just here, look at this one that I just pulled out of my eye and, and it'll come to you. Just look at it and it'll come to you. you, you trust me, it's gonna, you're gonna love this. Just look at it and it'll fly right at you. Hey. <laughs> All right, listen, you're gonna control me, man, because I'm tired, okay? I, you know how long it took me to find you? I'm exhausted. So you're in control. I, I'm like a remote control character now, all right? The blue light that's shooting out of the ground, that's called the warp node. Get me over to the warp node. All right, let's get out of here. Good God, you really got to think for those dogs, huh? All right, listen, press the interact button to warp over. Oh! All right, and that's how we do it. Let's go. Ah, uh, you want to soak this place in before we leave, huh? I, I get it. Really? Really? You're going to go back inside and watch TV? All right. We interrupt this program for an important breaking news. The beaked monster with dogs in its eyes has attacked again, this time robbing the Cherorpian Science Center of valuable cloning equipment. Sally Chair is live on the scene. Thanks, Chuck. 
The two white fluffy dogs that seemed to power the beaked monster were crying today as the beaked monster broke into the Cherubian Science Center and effortlessly made off with valuable cloning equipment. Let's talk to the Science Center manager, or whatever his title is, and get his thoughts on this. This never would have happened if that idiot hadn't have brought those two dogs into our city. Cherorpia is no place for creatures like that. They have four legs, they walk, they refuse to sit in chairs, but we still allowed them to stay. And now this, my cloning equipment. Fuck this, fuck this bullshit. Fuck, shit, ass, fuck. Um, oh, oh my, oh, um, back to you in the studio, Chuck. Ahem, ahem, <clears throat> sorry about that, folks. Clearly, lots of outrage over these dogs and this beaked monster. Uh, in other news, the chair fair is here, and this year, everything's on a stick. We got chairs on a stick, we got armchair rests on a stick, Bobby Joe's on the scene live. Hey, what's up? I'm Bobby Joe. I'm at the big chair fair. This shit's fucking crazy this year. We got shit all on sticks here. This is fucking wild. Good thing that, um, giant beak monster isn't harassing us over here because it's a lovely day out, and there's no trouble whatsoever. It's a nice place here today. No giant beaked monster here. He only was at the cloning place that has all the cloning equipment. Oh boy, look, there's more things on sticks. We got little tiny cars on sticks. We got babies on sticks. Everything's on a stick. It's all deep fried, too. Back to you. Oh boy, that sounds like a lot of fun. Too bad I'm cooped up here in this fucking piece of shit studio. Fuck this. Fuck everything. I'm the fucking news anchor. Fuck you. I don't give a shit. Fuck all of this stuff. Uh, you want to soak this place in before we leave, huh? I, I get it. You know that monster that stole your dog's his name is Glorcon. He's got your dogs plugged into his eyes like power babies. It, ma it made him unstoppable. So, this, this is your digs, huh? This is your hood? What's rent like around here? Do you rent or do you own? It took me forever to find you. Looked all over the place. Thank God, I'm gonna dump your ass off at my boss. I'm gonna get my space money. Then I'm gonna go to this place in my home world where I get all crazy messed up called empty peepers. But what do you know about that? You're just a dirty chair orpian. I'm sorry for being spacist. Jeez, what's with all the purple? Do you guys have strict homeowners association guidelines? Or, or are you a bunch of fucking idiots? Haha, <laughs> just kidding, I'm, I'm purple. I like purple, obviously. But seriously, come on, we gotta go. Huh? <coughs> whoa! Whoa, 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 holy shit! Whoa, <coughs> whoa, whoa! Oh, well, look who it is. I'm locking you here and making a citizen's arrest. Do you not think I don't know who you are, huh? Shake your head, yes or no. Answer me! What's the matter with you? Answer me! Do you not think that I do not know who I you are? I think he wants you to answer him. Yeah, answer me. Answer the question. Nod your head yes, like this, or shake it no, like this. You gotta nod your head yes, or shake it no. Let like, me tell you, like this. You either go, uh-huh, or mm -hmm, like that, right? Yeah, that, that's, just answer his question. Just answer his question. Just pick an answer. It's yes or no, one or the other. Pretty simple math. I told you that warp node's turned off. Get away from it. Get, get, get away from that warp node. I'm so sick of this, I'm an old man, and I gotta put up with this bullshit! I think I hate you for making me sit in the sun without my hat, or lotions, 
You're damn straight, I know who you are. I've seen you all over the news, and that's why I'm placing you under citizen's arrest. Cause you had those dogs, and you let that giant bird-beaked monster take him, and now they're in his eyes, and everything's gone topsy-turvy. Do you feel sorry for what you've done? Answer me, yes or no, do you feel any remorse? Dude, just you're a heartless monster. It's bad enough you have the two dogs. Now you're hanging out with a purple walk person. It's unchair-like, you know? It's against the chair members to walk. Man, I don't have time for this bullshit. I got a motherfucking sword. You threat me, boy? I ain't for you. Come on, let's do it. Well, you should be, asshole. Let's beat this guy's ass. Press the attack button. I ain't afraid of you. I served eight tours in the civil chair war. Or nine, or three. Doesn't matter, more than one. Yeah, I'm walkist. I'm trying to hurt your feelings. My father was a walkist. My grandpappy was a walkist. I voted for a walkist. Chair opians have moved on from this walking bullshit. Fuck you. I'm gonna inject you with chair AIDS. Jesus Christ. Yeah, I'm gonna inject you and Jesus Christ with chair AIDS. Oh my God, that's so offensive. All right, enough. We're, gonna, we're hurting this old man. I don't care. I'll turn on the news! Ah, just stop hitting me! <laughs> I turned on your warp nodes! Hey, it's elderly uncle, abuse uncle. time! <laughs> I turned on your warp nodes! <laughs> Don't hurt me no more with the knife! <laughs> You're, you're, you're an idiot! Ow! Oh man, okay, we're I'm really gonna, gonna do this, huh? We're gonna murder! Yeah, let's go for Ow. it! Shit! Let's kill this motherfucker! Oh my fuck! Shit! I'm dead. Oh uh, shit, uh, I think we just killed him. We better get out of here. I don't want to get in trouble. Man, that was pretty fucked up. We need to get our story straight. He came at me with a knife, okay? What the hell, man? What the hell? You, you you made me kill him! Whatever, let's just get out of here before the chair police or whatever the fuck you chair people use as cops get here. Man, I can't believe you killed this guy. What, what, what do you want to hang out at the scene of the crime? Let's go! We just killed the guy, can we please go? What the hell? All the nodes are locked down again. Shit. We, we, we gotta look around and figure this out. Shit, this is the science building we saw on the news. The all inventor? The stuff I got. Yeah, yeah, I got stuff too. Hey, what is all this stuff for? I don't know, but it's ours now. Hey, look, there's somebody coming out. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna have to be on a robot. Oh, you too much. Who are you? Hey, what the fuck? Huh. Well, that's that. All right, come on, let's go to the telepod. It's back the other way. The inventor of clones, huh? That's a dangerous game, man, playing God. Personally, I don't think anyone should have that kind of power, not even God himself. The inventor of black holes. What did you guys do before him? Just stand the whole time? Boy, I'm blown away. I would have never expected that Chorapian science is all about, there's a lot of sitting involved. The inventor of science. Fucking finally, we're at the telepod.
this is the telepod. So telepods are, are, are how we get around, okay? That's how we travel in the cosmos. They teleport us to where we'd like to go. So we're gonna use it to go to my boss's office so I can drop your ass off, your stupid ass off, and get my space money and get the hell out of here, you know what I mean? And go live my life. Go ahead and hit the button to uh, teleport us to my boss's office. That's when I woke up and realized she was dead. Oh, Trover. Okay, boss, I'm sorry it took me so so long, but here's the chair orpian uh, in mint condition, so I'll take my space money and be on my way. Thank you very much. Actually, Trover, some things have changed since we've last talked. I'm gonna need you to stay partners with the chair orpian. Your job's not over yet. Come on! You said all I had to do was find the stupid chair orpian and bring them to you, and then, and then I'd get my space money! Trover, shut the fuck up. I have the abstainers on the hollow dish phone. We are the abstainers. Holy shit, that's what the abstainers look like? They look just like the, the guy who's got the dogs in his eyes causing all this trouble. Shut the fuck up, Trover. No one needs to hear your commentary about everything. The abstainers would like to talk with the chair Orpian. It is true that we look like Gorkon. He was one of us. We were four, but he has broken free. Chair Orpian, is it true you were the owner of the dogs that power Glorcon? Yeah, it's definitely the right Chair Orpian. You should have seen, seen their apartment. We're not talking to you. Oh, so what Trover is saying is true. You are the owner of the dogs. I told you guys. We need to meet this Chair Orpian face to face. You must come to our home world, our inner sanctum. Wow, whoa, you're in the inner sanctum void, wow. Nobody's ever been to the Abstainer's Inner Sanctum. Oh, mama. This is gonna be, that's gonna be quite a, a little deluxe travel package. How does somebody even get to the Abstainer's Inner Sanctum? You must find the Crystal of Ithacles. It is located in a place called Schleamy World. Oh, oh, I know where Schleamy World is. All right, okay. All right, Trover. Now, I'm sure you can see better as to why you, I needed you to stick around. We need you to protect this Chair Orpian. You and the Chair Orpian are a team. You're partners now. You're together. You're you're gonna need to go get that fucking crystal in from Schleamy World so that you can meet the abstainers face to face. Once you retrieve the crystal of Ithacles, you can plug it into the telepod. It will give you access to our inner sanctum. We must meet this Chair Orpian in person. It's of the utmost importance. Okay, all right, we got it. Jesus, Chair Orpian, uh, go ahead and hit the button on the telepod there uh, to teleport to Schleamy World. Yeah, Jesus Christ, man, fuck. This is bullshit. Trover, I don't want to hear any bullshit from you. Fuck you. Yeah, all right, okay. You should have fucking let me know that this was po a possibility. I don't like surprises. Trover, there are higher things at stake here than, than that right now. So quit being a little baby and do as I ask. I'm your boss. I'm the one who pays your bills. Man, we had a deal and you're changing it Chair up. Scorpion, hit the button on the telepod. I don't want to hear Trover anymore. Okay, we're going to hang up now. Good, good luck. Yeah, we had a deal, man. You know, you I, bring back the Chair Orpian, get some space money. That was the deal. Trover, there's bigger things at stake now. I don't know what you were going to go do, but whatever it was, it was going to be supplied by my space money. Whatever recreational activities that you were so excited to go do that now you can't do that, that are making you so upset. That was gonna be paid for by my space money. Just like everything in your in your little shitty existence is funded by my space money. So I need you to shut the fuck up and do what the fuck I tell you to yeah, do. Yeah, okay, I'm, I'm doing it, I, but am I, 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 I just don't like surprises, you know? I know I'm work for hire, but just let me, give me a heads up, you know? G tell me there's the chance that this could turn into a bigger job. Trover, all. I don't give a shit about what you just said. Shut the fuck up and just Chair Orpian, will you hit the button on the telepod? Get the fuck out of here. Go do the work. Find the fucking crystal of Ithacles and plug it into the stupid telepod so you could go meet face to face with the abstainers. Get the fuck out of here. Shit is fucked up right now. Hit the button on the telepod to tra to, to to go to the Shlimi world. Press the button so we can get the hell out of here. Fuck you, boss. You're a piece of shit. Jesus, man, Jesus fucking, that guy's a fucking asshole. Man, I didn't, I didn't sign up for this shit, you know? And now the abstainers are involved. Fuck, man, the, the, the abstainers, man. Imagine every time you've jerked off, they, they've seen it. Every time you, 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 they watch, they know, they literally can describe to the minorest detail every time you've taken a shit. They know every single moment. They know everything, they've seen everything. I don't like them. I don't, I, I don't, I, I they make me uncomfortable. The abstainers.
Hey, press the telepod button so we can get out of here! Pop-Up and I need your help. Alright, who, who is this guy? I told you I'm Mr. Pop-Up. I called a number. I, I don't know who I called. They're just supposed to come and help me. Alright, well, it's not us. No, no, leave. No, fuck off. There's a man named Michael and he, and he built a house on the bluff and, and that's not zoned for residential usage. It's zoned for public use and I'm very upset about it. We don't know what the fuck you're talking about, dude. It's got nothing to do with us. We got our own shit to deal with, alright? You gotta help me out. I can't do anything! This guy, Michael, he's a total asshole! He's he's treated me like shit my whole life! Good! Now go away! No! It's bad! He thinks he's hot shit and can do whatever he wants! It's not fair! Sitting up there in his, in his red house, I would have built my house up there, but I didn't because I know how to follow the rules! You're disgusting! You're naked! Go away! I know you guys will help me if I just keep at it! The squeaky wheel gets the grease! That's what my mom taught me as a baby. If I kept crying, she would eventually give me more nipple milk. I learned that at a very young age. If I'm really loud and abrasive and complain, I'll eventually get what I want. I'm gonna rip that little band-aid that's covering up whatever's under there and put it on your mouth. I'm sorry you don't like me. I, I really am, but I need your help and, and you're the only people here. So if you just help me, then I'll go away. Otherwise, you're just going to have to deal with it. I'm Mr. Pop-Up, and I got no one else to, to turn to. <coughs> Are you mentally handicapped? What's wrong with you? Do you know what bothers me the most about Michael? His inability to listen. Do you hear yourself right now? Did I mention Michael masturbates in public? I saw it. He was alone in his room, which is technically on public property, and guess what? That's also against the law. Why were you watching him masturbate? I wasn't! I, 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 I wasn't watching him masturbate! I was trying to admire the view! The view of- Bluff, but his house was in the way, so I didn't, I didn't, I didn't leave because I shouldn't have to. That bluff is for the community, not for Michael's private time moment. It's unfair, and someone needs to stop it. This guy's a peeping tom. I am an upstanding citizen. Michael is the criminal here. A man like that can't be trusted. A man with no honor is worse than dead. Michael needs to be taken care of and not and not in a nice, helpful way. He needs to learn that there are repercussions. There are consequences. If you break the law, you should be punished. He needs to be punished. Shut the fuck up. The zoning laws are very clear. You know, like, have you ever played The Sims? There's there's residential, there's commercial, and, and um, go oh, ow! I'm floating up here now. You can't hit me up here. And um, there's industrial, and and that bluff is not zoned for either of those. Fuck asshole! And that bluff is not zoned for either of those. God, I wish I had a gun instead of a sword. Zoning laws are there for a reason, and Michael is on. Oh, no! Zoning laws are there for a reason, and Michael is on, is on that bluff for no reason. He thinks he's the king of Shle Shleamy World, but Shleamy World has no king. It's a democracy with checks and, checks and balances and zoning laws. They're, they're, they're there for a reason, unlike... Oh my... Oh, Jesus! Oh my god, that one hurt. Zoning laws are there for a reason, and Michael is on, is on that bluff for no reason. He thinks he's the king of Shle Shleamy World, but Shleamy World has no king. It's a demo- <laughs> oh, I, I, Hold on, I'm choking on something here. I'll be right back. Jesus, I hope whatever he's choking on kills him. Alright, you got it. Let's keep going. Oh, help! Being attacked! Shit, there's a bunch of little 
gremlins over there. They just killed me. Y you see the hearts on, on, on your controller? When those go down to zero, I die. And if you find any red power babies, those things will give me health. The more important thing is we focus on finding the crystal of Ithocles. Oh, looking for the crystal of Ithocles, huh? Well, I have the crystal of Ithocles right here. I'm the one who has the crystal. Big surprise, big reveal. Holy shit, how did you get that? The abstainers gave it to me like 50 years ago to hold on to. You guys want it? You guys need this? Of all the people that have it, yes. We need it, please! Okay, well now you have to do what I say! Get that guy Michael off the bluff! Here, I'll, I'll help you out! You're gonna need a chair upgrade because you can't even see over this log! So I'm gonna give you a chair upgrade! Here it comes! Your chair upgrade! Hey, what the hell you notice that you just spit all over the chair no, upgrade? No, no, no! I, I just gave him the chair upgrade! It's it's how we do things around here! I, we spit! Pop up with me! It's your new magical chair upgrade! Pop up! Yeah, pop up with me! Okay, good! Now do it again! You can pop up even higher! Okay, good! Do you see the house? Use your blinky blinksters and look at it! It's way back there! You have to see it! Don't you see it? It's the house with smoke coming out of the- Okay, great! That's Michael's house! That's the house I need you to destroy! Now don't forget! Pop up or down if you need a better vantage point! Don't be stupid! Don't be a jerk! Use the pop-up ability often! Without it, you're screwed! Missing a hard jump? Pop up! Can't see where to go next? Pop up or down! I'll be back soon! Now, go get rid of that goddamn house and the crystal is yours! I missed her pop-up! And I want justice! So hey, now that we have that pop-up ability, can you see over the log? Like, see what killed me over there? Oh, so it was these little pieces of shit that killed me. Now with your pop-up ability, you can, you, we can see this stuff and avoid it. Alright, listen, if you ever lose track of me, press down on the button that's on the screen and your chair will focus right on me. That's the connection from the Power Babies. <laughs> Yep, see, now you're focused on me. You don't have to move the kid. Ay 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 ay! Yep, see, now you're focused on me. You don't have to move the camera to follow me around anymore. Yo, whoa, 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 whoa! Oh, man, I like to fall off cliffs. Pop up! Pop up so you can see better. Man, we were supposed to just get the crystal of Ithocles and get on out of here to the abstainers area. And now we gotta deal with all this bullshit, you know? We're in neck deep now, man. This is a bunch of nonsense. Well... Oh, you just got another green power, baby. Dude, you are making my day. Hey man, I gotta say, at least that pop-up guy's not harassing us anymore, you know? Been a lot of characters harassing us so far. My boss is giving me a bunch of heat. The abstainers are probably gonna... Alright, this is what I'm talking... ...about, man. Thank you! Green power, baby! Mama's gonna get stoned!
crap. Well, this is as far as we go. Got ourselves a real gate here, keeping us... Oh shit, look, look above the gate. One, one of these things got a thumbs up on it. Before they were all three. Oh, easy, easy, hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. It's, this is a gate. You gotta solve a puzzle or, or do something else. You can't ru rush through it. Oh shit, look, look above the gate. One, one of these things got a thumbs up on it. Before they were all... Oh yeah, I, I see, I see what you're looking at up there. Three buttons. Ooh, that's a lot harder than one button. Jeez, that's three buttons, I don't know. That's rough, that's pretty hard. I don't know how you're... Whoa, holy shit! We got two green thumbs up! One more puzzle somewhere. Try, try popping up higher. I bet there's another puzzle up there. These, these ridiculous buttons or something. Whoa, well, holy shit, dude! I mean, I can see that puzzle from down here. That, that's insane! That's an insane puzzle! I mean, what the hell? Y you doing alright? Jesus, I don't know. Sh should we check online? I mean, maybe there's a strategy guide online. What the hell were they thinking? What the hell were these were the developers thinking with all these buttons? That's not fun. This isn't fun. This isn't a good game. Just a bunch of buttons. It's lazy. Fuck this, dude. Come down. C come back down. C f screw this shit. Screw this shit, man. Just come down. We're not messing around with this. We're not messing around with buttons. No way. Uh-uh. I'm fed up. I waited around at this gate too, for far too long. Let's just bash it down. Ba bash the gate down. Fuck that puzzle, man. Let's brute force our way ahead. We gotta just brute force our way through it. Bash the puzzle. I mean, bash the, uh, the, the door. Ba bash the gate. Let's just bash through the gate. We gotta just break through it. Fuck it. I'm not sitting around with that puzzle. I don't care. Just, uh, I'll take all the damage and, and, you know, and whatever. I, I don't even care. Let's just break through the door. Let's break through the puzzle. Come on. Br let's bust through the puzzle. Let's let's emerge on the other side. Let's break through this wall. Let's break down the wall. Let's break through the door. Let's knock down the gate. We just gotta bash it down. Bash the gate down, man. Just just let's knock this shit down. I I'm not fucking around with these puzzles no more. Uh, wh 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 what the fuck kind of shit is this with these puzzles? We gotta break through the game. Dude, come down. C come back down. Just come down. We're not messing around with this. We're not messing around with buttons. I waited around at this gate too for far too long. Let's just bash it down. Ba bash the gate down. Fuck that puzzle, man. Dude, come down. C come back down. Just come down. We're not messing around with this. We're not messing around with buttons. I waited around at this gate too for far too long. Let's just bash it down. Ba bash the gate down. Fuck that puzzle, man. Dude, come down! C come back down! Just come down! We're not messing around with this! We're not messing around with buttons! I waited around at this gate too for far too long! Let's just bash it down! Ba bash the gate down! Fuck that puzzle, man! Dude, come down! C come back down! Just come down! We're not messing around with this! We're not messing around with buttons! I waited around at this gate too for far too long! Let's just bash it down! Ba bash the gate down! Fuck that puzzle, man! Dude, come down! C come back down! Just come down! We're not messing around with this! We're not messing around with buttons! I waited around at this gate too for far too long! Let's just bash it down! Ba bash the gate down! Fuck that puzzle, man! Dude, come down! C come back down! Just come down! We're not messing around with this! We're not messing around with buttons! I waited around at this gate too for far too long! Let's just bash it down! Ba bash the gate down! Fuck that puzzle, man! Dude, come down! C come back down! Just come down! We're not messing around with this! We're not messing around with buttons! I waited around at this gate too for far too long! Let's just bash it down! Ba bash the gate down! Fuck that puzzle, man! Dude, come down! C come back down! Just come down! We're not messing around with this! We're not messing around with buttons! I waited around at this gate too for far too long! Let's just bash it down! Ba bash the gate down! Fuck that puzzle, man! Dude, come down! C come back down! Just come down! We're not messing around with this! We're not messing around with buttons! I waited around at this gate too for far too long! Let's just knock this shit down a little stronger! Yeah, screw that gate!
once this adventure's over, I'm gonna be wasted for a while. Oh yeah, green power, baby. You done did it. Water, boy, oh. Hey, holy shit, there's a there's one! A green power baby! The green ones are super important to me. Hey, excuse me. How's it going? My name's Tony. I'm Upgrade Tony. I got a real issue over here, if you guys wouldn't mind just uh, checking in with me. I got a real issue right now. Hey, yeah, what's the problem? I got these little ankle biters over here. They're trying to kill me. It's giving me anxiety. Okay, well, what do you want us to do? I want you to kill them. If you kill them, I'll give you this awesome Power Baby upgrade that gives you a double jump and a glide. You can glide around with a double jump. It's so much fun. It's the funnest thing you've ever seen. Oh man, I I've always wanted a double jump glide power baby upgrade. Yeah, I bet you do. If you kill these ankle biters and alleviate me of all this stress and anxiety I've got, and panic attack, then I'll give you this power baby upgrade. The upgrade power babies are the most powerful ones. Uh, my favorite kind of power baby. We gotta take care of this. Yeah, why don't you take care of this stuff? Go be a fucking stupid little bitch about it. Dude, what the fuck are you doing? Those were my pets. What are you, what are you out of your fucking mind? You just told us to kill them. What are you talking about? I told you to kill the ones in the courtyard. The wild feral ones. The ones you just killed were my domesticated pets. They're my friends. Well, Jesus, man, you gotta be a little more specific. Shit, dude, I'm sorry. You know what? I don't even care anymore. Take your fucking upgrade here. It's on the fucking counter. I don't even know why I'm giving it to you. But here, here it is. Take your... Okay, check this out. Watch this. This is crazy. Fucking eat each other! You see the shit? He's eating the other ones! Fucking insane! That's what they do when you put them close together! Isn't that crazy? And all the powers are now in, in, in combined into this one power, baby! And here we go! We're ready to double jump, baby! We got the double jump now! You fucking murderous, evil bastard monsters that killed my fucking best friends! I'm gonna- I gotta go! I gotta move on! I gotta pack up! This place has too many memories! I can't live here! I can't be here! I can't have my stand here no more! This place has too many memories! It just reminds me of my friends that you killed! You're the definition of monsters! Like that movie with the one actress who played the monster woman who killed men! I'm out of here! Jeez, we really ruined that guy's day! But hey, I can double jump now and glide around! This is fun! Let's play with this new upgrade! Yahoo! yip dee dee Looking out, partner on the green power, baby. Sick.
Huh, I wonder if there's any kind of secret areas around here. I, I, I got a feeling. Oh man, this means a lot to me, dude. These green power babies are like my fucking... This is what keeps me pumping. We should probably go over to the left and, and check out that area, because there might be so, like a green power baby or two, and those are really important for me, man. It means a lot to me. You don't understand. Like, I need some skin in this game too, you know? Mr. Pop-Up, what's taking you guys so long? Are, are you guys lost or something? It's your friend, isn't it? He's dead weight. He's like a broken wagon wheel. You gotta get rid of him. You should partner up with me. I can float. What can he do besides solicit oral sex to naive tourists? Sure, there's no proof that he does it, but it doesn't mean it's not true. It's like vaccines causing autism. Hey, what are you guys talking about? Model airplanes. Oh, that's a weird thing to talk about. Look at him walking around like a purple idiot. What an idiot. He, he doesn't deserve you. He, he, you know what? You, we, we should kill him. It'll be so easy. We'll, we'll do it right after he pushes M Michael's house over the, over the bluff. He'll peer over the edge and then we'll give him a slight nudge. And if anyone asks, we'll say he jumped. Okay, excuse me. Hold on a second. What, what is going on? Fine. I'll leave. But hurry up. I really want that house off the cliff. I just drank 64 ounces of pure heaven. This is the perk of the job. I'll drink as much water as you give me. All right, so look, there's these flowers that open when you look at them, and then and then they bounce me up. They're bounce flowers, so look at them, and then the petals will open. You should jump me on that little son of a bitch. See better. Alright, so look, there's these flowers that open when you look at them, and then and then they bounce me. Baby's collecting them. This is what makes me devoted to you and your cause, you know? What? You did it. You murdered my pets and the wild ones. But I, I don't get it. They look the same to me. Yeah, well, they are the same, except for my pets were domesticated, you murderer. Don't you even know how pets work? Yeah, I, I know, it's just, you gotta be more specific, okay? You didn't even listen to me when you came up here. You just ran past me and killed my pets. Whatever. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go mourn the loss of my little pets that used to sleep with me. They used to sleep in my bed. There was Bobby, Fluffy, Scampy, Oh, hey, check it out, a secret little area. It's our little secret island here. 
So, you know, power babies are like super important, man, because the red ones give me health, but like the green ones, I'm trying to save those because they're an endangered species. And if you collect them, that'll really put some skin in the game for me, you know? It's like tipping an Uber driver. Plus they get me really high when I have them in my eye socket. Like I get really high off of a power baby's energy. It's like uh, when shamans make you drink ayahuasca to reflect for 24 hours on the spirits that are haunting your... Fuck you! Quit jumping me off the cliffs! Anyways, like I was saying, you know, if you collect them all, I swear to God, I will make sure there's some fucking insane thing at the end of this game. Like, at the very final part of this game, I- Yippee! Like I was saying, though, I will make sure that there's some insane-ass gift for you, but only if we collect all the green power babies. Cannonball! So, so back to what I was saying, only if we collect all the green power babies, all right? But if you don't, you know, fuck you. you that means you don't care about me. You just done got another green power baby. Cha-ching! Somebody give me a money dollar. Whoa! Woo, all right! you can drink it's water friday welcome to tgi waters where it's always refreshing
right, so look, there's these flowers that open when you look at them. And then, and then they bounce me up. They're bounce flowers. Whoa, yeah, see? Clones of Glorcon! You can't stop us! There's tons of us! There's a whole bunch of us and we're gonna kill you! We're gonna murder you! you you're not gonna get through! You're not gonna get very far with us around! There's so many of us! You, you could kill a couple, but we're just gonna keep coming at you! Hey, did you tell them about how they're not gonna get very far? No, I forgot! Shoot! Alright, you're not gonna get very far! Hold on, I wanted to say it! Okay, hold on! Alright, you go, you say it! You're not gonna get very far! Yeah, Fucking no, 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 no. Well, this guy's crazy! He's off the throttle! Killed them all. Let, let's keep going. What the hell? Oh, it's gonna keep warping it. We're here to make sure you don't proceed and interfere with Lord Khan's evil plan. Make sure you're working. Your stupid dogs are dying right yeah. now. Yeah, your stupid dogs are, are, are annoying and loud. And I, I wish we could just give them back. We can't give them back. Those are the dogs that power Lord Khan. Yeah, I know they are. Guess who's the smartest person in, uh, in this part of the world? Me. Whoa, whoa, hey, hey. Just get them. Okay, enough of that. Yeah. Uh, fuck you. Fuck you. Get him. No, you cut my. Too easy, man. How much this means to me, man. Zing, you don't get it. Glorcon is cloning up. Uh, to uh, kill him. Uh, kill my two. Uh, I love uh, 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 What are you gonna do? I'm gonna fuck you up, punk. You know, I kind of almost feel bad for these guys.
Dude, you are making my day! Partner, hit the button! It'll focus your vision on me! My fault? Sorry, just don't forget to get rid of Michael's house for me. I will see you soon! This is my house. This is where I live. It's in a properly zoned area. This is where residential houses are allowed to be. And Michael's house, you're going to destroy it. Otherwise, you won't get this. The crystal of Ithacles. Anyways, good luck, you fucking shit fucks. Fuck you. I'm going inside. Man, that guy's an asshole. gonna be a pain in my ass. I'm too old for this shit. Another green power baby? Geronimo! Another green power baby? What are you, Mother Teresa over here? <laughs> what a good guy. Whoa! God damn- <laughs> God damn it, seriously. Seriously. Oh. Yeah, we're gonna stop you from getting any further. Don't slam attack us though, please. Yeah, just whatever you do, don't use your slam attack. It'll hurt us like one point more damage than usual. You know, Oh, Holy shit, you just you just knocked that guy off the ledge. Christ, this looks like it's gonna be tricky. Try not to get me. 
Well, shit, that worked. G good, good job. Oh, look who it is, Thelma and Louise. I hope you guys are happy. I just buried my pets that you murdered. You fuck monsters I moved up here and created a new life for myself to get away from people like you and here you are I can't be safe anywhere oh fuck oh oh I'm so sad oh! hope you guys fucking die Trover and the Cheorpion. You think you're going to be able to defeat Glorcon's minions and clones, but you will never defeat us. And we will stop you and murder you before you're able to even come close to getting to Glorcon. Because we are the most powerful clones of Glorcons. Alright, everybody, attack! I'll fuck you up! Cheorpion, you think you're going to be able to defeat Glorcon's minions and clones, but you will never defeat us, and we will stop you and murder you before you're able to even come close to getting to Glorcon, because we are the most powerful clones of Glorcons. All right, everybody, attack! Yeah, you can't get nothing about me over here. I'm a tough customer. Sending all those clones after us like that. All right, well, well, we're basically at Michael's house. Let's go. Hey, Michael, come out! Hey, come out here! Knock, knock, hello! What? What do you want, man? This is a private event! I don't give a shit! We're here to push your house over the cliff! Oh, 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 you're pushing this house over! This one right here! Yeah, give me one sec! What the fuck are you doing? What is that? Is that... is that shit? Oh, sorry about that. I guess I forgot what direction my toilet was in. Oh, get the fuck out of here. Get the hell off my property. This is a private event. Look, asshole, we need the Crystal of Ithacles. Mr. Pop-Up said... Mr. Pop-Up? Crystal of Ithacles? Shit, that guy's just pissed because I ate his family. Wait, seriously? That's right. Well, what Pop-Up needs to realize is that we're all just meat. Their energy is still around. I just ate their meat, okay? Energy never dies. Their flesh can be consumed, but the spiritual energy is still in the cosmos, you fucking assholes. Tell you what, I'll give you my crystal of Ithacles right here. If you knock that boulder over the cliff on a Mr. Pop-Up's house and kill him. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm gonna go back inside where I have a, a whole mess of pregnant ladies 
strapped onto the floor where I'm using an intricate network of fluids to inject into their bodies and induce early birth so that I can consume the flesh of their fetuses, okay? Is that okay? <laughs> Jesus, another one of these types. Cherubian, turn me facing you so we can talk for a second. All right, listen, I wasn't even supposed to be here. What do you want to do? Do you want to kill Mr. Pop-Up? We, 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 we got to kill somebody. We got to pick one. Because I want to get this stupid shard of Ithacles and get out of here. Okay, so what, do, what, are, you, what are you thinking? You, you want to kill Mr. Pop-Up? Come on, partner, like we did with the old man. Yes or no? Like, nod your head yes or shake your head no. So... You want to kill Michael then? Okay, yeah, I mean, the guy, this guy, Michael, is talking about injecting fluids into pregnant women and inducing pregnancy and eating the, their babies. I mean, I, I see where you're coming from. Okay, so, you want to kill Michael then, yeah? Listen, we gotta kill one of them, okay? We can't be pacifistic here. We need that stupid crystal of Ithacles. Now, this guy Michael threw shit in your face. Is that something you're into? You like getting shit all in your mouth? And I saw it get in your mouth. I saw you swallow some of it. Listen, I won't judge you. Is that... Are you into that? Is that is that like a thing? You you like that? Is that why you don't want to... Well, good for you. Okay, listen, I've had it. Uh, th th this whole complex, dumb dialogue tree. Nod your head yes or shake it no bullshit. I'm over it. We're not doing- you and I are never gonna do this again, okay? We gotta pick one of them. I say we pick the guy behind us, the weirdo who's eating babies. It'll save us a walk. Okay, let's kill Michael then. Knock in a house filled with innocent pregnant women right off a cliff. Here we go. Here it goes! Dude, what the hell? Knock it off! Stop! You're fucking done, man. You're done. You're gonna kill a bunch of pregnant ladies and ruin my dinner. All right. Hey, you. Hey. Oh my God, you guys did it. You killed Michael. Oh my God. You. You guys actually. Ow! I thought you guys would have just picked one of those crystals up off the ground. It seems like the most logical way to way to go about things. What are you talking about? You did it. I didn't know. I didn't think you would have had what it takes. I'm not gonna lie. I'm really sad that Michael's gone, but I've got bigger issues ahead of me. I need to find out where all my pregnant wives are. Here's your crystal of Ithacles, you dumb dumb. These are all over the place. I pulled this one out of my ass. My little schmuggler got all rosy. Oh, Jesus Christ. He had that crystal up his ass. I don't want that in my... I don't want that in my telepod. All right, get the fuck out of here. Go to that special teleportation warp node. That'll warp you back to the... Ew. That'll warp you back to the telepod you came in. Get the fuck out of my world, you limp leg, chair fuck, and you stupid suck it head. I'm Mr. Pop-Up, and I'm gonna beat off thinking about you guys. I gotta tell you, you know, what? you surprised me back there, Chair Orpian. I didn't what? think you had what it takes to kill somebody. You know, I thought you were just a baby that needed their hand held, you know? But I was wrong. You got some grit. What? All right, you got a green power, baby!
You gotta watch your step!
about these bushes or what? What are we doing right now? Checking bushes out? We're checking out every little nook and cranny, huh? Now that's what I'm talking about. Green power, baby. Well, wow, we teleported. We're here. Holy shit. What, th there's crystals everywhere. How do we miss all these? Or do we not notice these before? They're all over the place. And there's a crystal. Look, there's uh, there's crystals there. All right, I'm plugging the crystal of Ithacles into the telepod. All right, listen, we're... Back in the telepod, and the first order of business is let's store some of those green power babies. All right, so just rotate around until you see the, the, the big red button. That's the power baby suction button. Just ro You'll find it. Just rotate around until you see the big red button. You're going to be doing this all the time, so you better just... Oh shit, you got enough green power babies to give me a, a a new hit point, a new health point. Oh my god, I'm gonna now I can take more damage. Oh, see that's what happens when you collect these green power babies. Alright, okay, we're we're really rocking and rolling. Oh you did it! I got another hit point! I can take one more hit of damage! All thanks to your green power baby hunting! All right, that's what I'm talking about. All the power babies from the whole level. You did it, you made me happy. You are a cool person. Oh shit, you better answer that, partner. That's probably the boss. Trover, chair person, good work. You got the crystal, and it looks like Trover's already installed it and upgraded the telepod. Now you just have to teleport to the Abstainer's home world, Inner Sanctum. Very rare opportunity for anyone. Good work, guys. Uh, we'll talk to you soon. Bye. Jeez, Chair Orpian, I gotta admit, I never saw you, I never thought you had it in you. To cold-bloodedly murder somebody like that. Whew, glad I'm not on your bad side. You know, you're gonna do pretty good out here in this cosmos, you know? You're gonna do pretty good when we part ways right after this next part of the game, when we split up. Cause I'm going my way and you're going your way. And they're not intertangled at all. And that's all I gotta say about that. Jeez, this is where the abstainers live? In a giant foggy void? Must be nice. What are you doing? Come see, talk to us. We are the abstainers. We request your presence. We must talk to you in person. We're very interesting to look at. You'll want to see us. Trust me, you'll want to, you'll want to come and be in our presence. It's cool. It looks cool, especially in virtual reality. Because you'll, you'll be able to look around and feel a strong sense of presence, like you're actually here. So come to our inner sanctum and talk to us, please. We have things to speak with uh, you about. They have arrived. Welcome, Trover. Yeah, uh, yeah, thanks for having us. Ah, you know uh, yes, welcome. It's true. The dogs were yours. The bond you have is strong. You are the chair-bound one. He who is dis destined to defeat Glorcon. We are the abstainers. We see all. We know all. But we can no longer be sure of the future. Slow talker. Now that Glorcon has broke free, he was one of us. We were four in total. Now we're just three. I mean, it's a bunch of bullshit, really, if you think about it. He fucked us. Now we're three. We abstain from interfering with anything because we don't fuck with shit and we're the abstainers and we abstain from stuff um listen so the clones we we've been running into glorcon clones 
They said a bunch of bad stuff is coming. Oh, oh, jeez. Oh, my God. Oh, dub, 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 Oh, dub, dub, dub. That's bad. That's just bad stuff. It's a bad sign. Uh, this means Glorcon is proceeding with his plan to destroy the universe, the cosmos, everything. Wait, what? What? D destroy the whole cosmos? That's right, you little purple punk. And you two together are our, our only hope. Uh, you must collect Glorcon the clones. You must collect their guts. We will be able to use that to peer into Glorcon's mind so we're able to see what his next moves are. It's the only way we can stop the horrible things from happening. What are you talking about, us? I, I, I don't want I, I to deal with this. Get the fuck out of here. Hurry. Get the fuck out of here. Just to reiterate, we are the abstainers. We used to be able to see all timelines. Every version of reality we could peer into. We abstained from interfering with everything. Now that Glorcon left, we're broken down. We can't see anything. We don't know what the fuck is going on. We need to peer into Glorcon's mind so we know what his plans are. So that we can stop It's a bunch of bullshit. This whole thing is bullshit. We weren't expecting it. We weren't planning for it. It's fucking fucked up. It's like if you if your car broke down on the freeway and you're like, fuck, I wasn't expecting this. I wasn't planning for this today. I, I, I had a whole bunch of shit to do. That's the experience we're living in right now. This is fucking bullshit. We are abstainers. We abstain from things. We are very zen. We're zen creatures. We are large. We're weird. We're sci-fi. I mean, what do you what more do you want from us? Go, hurry, go collect Glorcon's clone's DNA. Get the Glorcon DNA, take it to Voodoo Person. Voodoo Person will chime it with delicious voodoo science. So Jesus, that... finally they're gone. Now I can take these pants off. Oh, oh, that's the stuff. Gotta air it out sometimes, you know? Oh, yes, I know. I'm gonna leave mine Whoa, on. Oh, hey, wh why are you back here? We, we thought you left. Yeah, sorry, sorry, we're just, I guess we're coming back to make sure we didn't miss anything All important. you missed was us removing our pants, or at least I did. I'm airing out my thing. Oh, okay, that's, yeah, all right. Yeah, gotta air it out. Airing out my thing right now. Mmm, there's a nice steady breeze down below the catwalk here. Just hits my thing. It feels so nice. Okay, cool, so you guys all... Airing out your things, no, or...? No, I'm not airing out my thing. Neither am I. You guys all sound the same. I couldn't really tell. I can't really tell who said what, but I guess that's cool. It's very cool. Especially with this breeze hitting my thing. Mmm. It feels so nice. All right, uh, I guess we should get going then. No, you can stay if you want to hear us talk about how we're airing out our things. I'm not airing my thing out. Neither am I. I know, but I'm airing my thing out. I took my pants off, and now my thing is dangling, and it's being aired out. Let's get out of here. Leave these guys to it. You know, it seems like they're they're doing some stuff that maybe, maybe we shouldn't be around for. Oh, you're welcome to stay. Mmm. Ah, the breeze is slapping against my thing right now. We have a very strong breeze below the catwalk. If only you could feel it. Huh, yeah. Yeah, I'd really prefer to leave if, if, if it's all the same to you. Uh, let's go. Let's get out of here. All right, well, we're, we're just going to sit here quietly as the breeze just encapsulates our things. Uh, I don't have my thing out. Neither do I. You know what I meant. Okay, all right. I, I, I'm just going to... Uh, if you want to be here for this, then that's cool. I'm just going to... I'm going to kind of just go go... I'm gonna take a little mental, uh, r break here, so ha enjoy yourself, I guess. Alright, that's it, enough talking. We must meditate. Are you ready to meditate, my fellow abstainers? Yes, yes let, let us meditate. meditate. Let's leave them to mm -hmm. him. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, cool. Let's get out of here. All right, that's probably the boss calling me. You should answer the phone. Hello? Hello? What's going on? Boss, we're in some deep stuff over here. The stakes have been raised. Glorcon's trying to destroy the whole universe, and the abstainers want us to stop him. <clears throat> Hold on, Chover. Shut the fuck up. Let me talk to the Chair Orpian here. Chair Orpian, is it true? Have the stakes been raised? Huh? 
Huh. Okay, so what you say is true, Trover. The stakes have been raised, according to the chair or people. That's what I said! Shut up, Trover! Trover, what are you gonna do? You gonna fucking sit on your little pansy ass while the whole cosmos gets blown up and destroyed? Or are you gonna fucking pony up? You and the Chair Orpian are the only hope. The abstainer said it to me earlier. I didn't want to tell you about it. You're bitching and moaning. You're gonna to go to Shroomia, and you're gonna find Doopy Duper. He has a cauldron, a vessel, a little receptacle, whatever. I need you to fill up the Glorcon clone guts into the cauldron and, and come back to the telepod, all right? Now get the fuck out of here. I'm gonna go shoot some hoops. Well, you heard him. We gotta to go to Planet Shroomia. Man, I thought we would be wrapping it up back there. You know, this is turning out to be a way bigger deal than I thought it would be. You know, listen, I'm a whole monster. You're a Cherorpion. We're not meant to be a team, but we're partners now. You hear that? I acquiesce. We're partners. I don't want to be together with you, but we are. And we're in way over our heads, so, you know, just... Don't screw anything up. Let's just do what we came to do, all right? All right, here we are. Here in, here in shit land. About ready to get shit on. All right, boss said that Doopy Duper would, would have the cauldron, the magical vessel or whatever that we need to get, so keep your eyes peeled for that house. Normal, regular, single-story, ranch-style home. The two-car garage. Great, more pissed off things than what's dead. Fantastic. Duper would, would have the cauldron, the magical... Partner, come on, let's go find Doopy Duper. That little son of a bitch was hiding pretty good. You got it. It is 
not boring. We're just doing our jobs. We are clones of Glorcon. Yeah, but I'm bored. I don't want to stand here all day. I'm bored and I want to go do stuff. You're doing stuff right now by guarding this section of the of the area. Don't tell me what I'm doing. I know exactly what I'm doing. And nothing's happened so far. We've been here for how long? I'm tired. I'm tired too. You know, you're right. You're finally making a good point about this. I'm tired as well. I don't understand the ranking system. We're all the clones. We're all the same. No, some of us are bigger. And some of us have more, take more hits to kill and have like armor and things like that. Oh, so if you have armor, that means that you're bigger and tougher? Because that's, that's a bunch of. All right, partner, come on. We gotta find Doopy Dooper. Get a stupid cauldron. Got a lot of work ahead of us here. Whoa, well, well. Oh, well, look who it is. We got ourselves a little purple. Whoa, whoa. Look at this little character popping up, getting in our face over here. Partner, do you see Doopy Dooper's house in there? Single story? Doopy Dooper's place? What the fuck are you guys talking about? Get the fuck out of here. There's no fucking Doopy Doopers around here. Fucking idiots. Yeah, why don't you pop down? Yeah, pop down. You can't fucking pop up and look at us like this. Like, you better pop the fuck down. Yeah, pop down. <laughs> oh boy, what a team. These fucking Cherorpians completely ignoring the little purple eye hole monster. Boy, what a team. They're really gonna fucking figure things out together, aren't they? Anyways, this is a fucking fort. This is a Glorcon fort. This is the toughest fucking macho -ish fort you'll ever see. You're not gonna ever penetrate it, and so good luck. God, they're right. We are gonna blow this. We're screwed. We're not gonna be able to get in that fort. Let's just find Doopy Duper. Get that cauldron. Yeah, get the fuck out of here. We're busy talking about shit. Anyways, you see Clonefeld last night? Shit, Clonefeld's my favorite fucking show. Yeah, they run like four episodes a night on uh, syndication channels. Yeah, me, me too. I mean, yeah, I know. Love that show. All right, well, come on, partner, let's go. We gotta find Doopy Duper. Get that cauldron. Yeah, why don't you fucking go? Get the fuck let's out get back to garden. Listen, this partner, castle. I don't want to go over do? there. I don't want to be anywhere near this tough. area. It's, it's, it's what gross. It smells bad. It's a pool, a pond of decomposed power baby slime. Easy, easy, partner. You know, you better make sure every one of these jumps that you think about it and, and you time it just right because I'm not, I don't want to fall in this muck. And when I say muck, I'm referring to the ground up, disgusting remnants of power babies and the slimy dec... Oh, oh, this is just, you just, what's the matter with you? The power baby guts are all over me. I know it appears that I'm, I'm clean, but I can feel their dead bodies against me in my, in all that wetness was was essentially their dead corpses, and they're just rubbing all over me. Imagine your dog's all ground up, and then you having to splash around in their guts. You know, it's a, it's a power baby. All right, well, you know, we saved a life. Uh, I guess it helps make up for the thousands of power baby guts down there that you got all over me. All right, let's keep going, partner. Oh, look who it is. Look who's back. Little lost babies. Anyways, what were we talking about? Yeah, do you guys know what a wall is? Hey, listen, let me... I got this. All right, go ahead. Do you guys know what a wall is? No, wh tell why don't you, what you tell us? Is. It's a giant fucking wall. That you can't get past it all. You can't even get through it. You can't dig under it. You know what I'm talking about? Hey, give me a high five, man. Good work. Thanks, man. These little two fucking pumpkin heads babies. aren't going to be able to get why in here. So hard right. to find? Now they know what... Good now work. They know, now they understand what they're up against. Oh, look, 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 there they go. A couple of fucking idiots. Off on their way. Fucking dumbass piece of shits. Let's get back to guarding this fucking castle. Oh crap, it's more of these mushroom monsters! Oh, these little mushroom monsters are vicious, are, are aggressive. Be that guy. Don't be that guy that 
ignore someone crying for help. It's all God. Please, come on. Just, please. Look, 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 look. I see you're not looking. You're what? not looking. Not look. Are you looking? Help me. Do you hear this? This chair is not gonna get up and help me. Come on. I'm right here. I can see you not looking yet. Hey, partner. I think that might be Doopy Duper. Are you, are you Doopy Duper? Yeah, yeah, I'm Doopy Duper. That's right, that's me. Old bad luck, Doopy Duper. All right, listen. W w our boss sent us here because you're supposed to have some sort of magic cauldron vessel thing? You mean that bowl thing? Yeah, I know, that's long gone. Those chicken nugget characters stole it from me and locked it up in their castle fort thing. Those dudes? Damn it! Yeah, the only way to get into that fort is up on that cliff there. Just up there, past my house. Do you see it? Just right up there. You gotta turn your head to look. I'm pointing at it right now. Do you see it right up there? I'm just gonna wait right here until you look. Look up there. Yeah, no, do you see it? Okay, this is, did, how did you get through school even? Do you see it? Up there. Keep on looking. Yeah, that's it. And the only way you can get up to that cliff is if I reveal the secret staircase. Okay, yeah, so can you turn on the secret staircase? Oh, yeah, sure. I'll reveal it. It's super easy. I'll activate the secret staircase, but I just need you to help me move. Do you know how to pick stuff up and move it? Really? Well, that's all right. I got this chair upgrade you can use to help pick stuff up. And... <sighs> all right, now you can pick up and move things, like my TV. Ow. Try it out. Oh, that hurts. Oh, Ow. Come on now, stop it. Anywho, where was I? Oh, yeah, so... There you go. Now, if you wouldn't mind, bring it a little closer to me by using the D-pad. You can also rotate using left or right on the D-pad. Great! Now just set it right in front of me. I know it's bad to sit this close to the TV, but it's the only way I can watch my shows with these eyes. So just set it down right here, front and center. I want the TV to be in perfect right there. Now I can watch my shows. So, now I just need you to move those boxes over to that house right there. The one with the basketball hoop. You want some hard candies? Perfect! Right there is perfect. Yeah, now just set it anywhere in front of the house, right over there. You know, I've had... Oh, you did it! Thank you so much! You must have been in the Gifted and Talented program. Yeah, okay, so activate the secret staircase, please. 
Yeah, actually, I changed my mind. Can you move the boxes in the garage? I checked the weather and it said it could rain. You know, I don't want to risk it. It would soggy up the boxes and I don't want to soggy the boxes up. So, could you just put them in the garage so the boxes stay safe and dry? Then I'll, I'll promise I'll open the staircase, okay? Listen, we're in a lot of trouble here, okay? We can't fuck around with this shit. We need to know where this cauldron vessel thing is. I understand. Right, that's fine. Anywho. There! The boxes are in the garage, okay? Now reveal the damn staircase! Oh, shoot! I wanted you guys to hold off on doing that. I just checked the weather, and it looks like it's all cleared up. Plus, it's so dark and scary in that garage. What? Come on! This is bullshit! We had a deal! Now reveal the staircase! Please stop yelling at me. You're scaring me. You're scaring old Duper here. Oh my god! This, this, this is it then! No more after this! Uh, we do this and then we get the secret staircase! No more! I promise. I never break my promise. Outside is better, trust me. I've moved so much in the past 10 years, I've learned a thing or two. Bless your weak little heart for doing this. You're really making old duper happy here. Anywho, where was I? Oh yeah, so I've moved so- There, the boxes are outside. Now for fuck's sake, reveal the secret staircase. Okay, no need for foul language here. I will reveal the secret staircase, but not until one last thing. I want you to put the boxes on my roof. Go to hell! Hey, Ow. you want to get cheese? Oh, you got me. Oh, that was a hard one. Ow! Am I swelling up yet? Ow! Oh, stop it! Ouch! Ouch! Oh, the ow! Ow! Am I swelling up yet? Ouch! Jeez! Oh, you got me. Oh, that was a hard one. But, but I digress. Hey, you want to get up that cliff? Then I'm going to need you to put those boxes on that roof. My new roof. Do you realize what's at stake? The entire universe could cease to exist! The whole universe! I didn't realize how crazy this shit was until just earlier. The whole universe is at stake. Well, that sounds pretty good to me. Turn on the secret staircase. Put the boxes on the roof. Trust me, this is the last thing. I hate moving just as much as the next guy. I can't wait to move into my new home, though. I said I want them on the roof. Try it again. Anywho, where was I? Oh, yeah, so I don't understand why you can't figure this out. It's not that hard. Then you do it. What was I talking about again? Oh, yeah. Not that I was coming and going a whole lot, but now with that basketball hoop, I had no reason. I gave you the upgrade specifically so I didn't have to. Now get off your bum bum and get to work. Cherubians can't get off their ass, okay? Partner, we gotta figure out a way to get up that cliff. So like I was saying, I'll be able to... Hey, uh, what are you doing over there? Don't stack my boxes over there. The secret staircase can't come out with those boxes over there. Oh shit, are you thinking what I'm thinking, partner? Let's go back to what I was talking about. Fucking doopy duper probably greased the roof. That's why we can't get any traction. We keep sliding off. This is fucking bullshit. I wonder if my new neighbors will like basketball. I hope so. There is nothing worse than having a neighbor that you do not get along with. It can ruin everything. My last neighbor was the worst. They always left all their windows wide open so that I could see everything. I'd sit there and just watch them. I didn't want to, but I had to. What other option did I have? 
Their window was wide open. I would look out and I would see them quickly getting ready for work in the morning because, you know, they had overslept again, or they were having an intimate dinner with a work colleague. Are they allowed to do that? Sometimes they would fall asleep on the couch and I could not tell if they were still breathing. So I'd just go over there and wake them up to make sure. Screw you, you freaking assholes! Oh, that sounds too bad like my mom. What a bunch of ninner pickles. You guys are jerks. We had an arrangement. Up yours, you friggin' buttwad. You're all buttwads. You guys are jerks. You're a bunch of friggin' jerks. Bunch of no gooders, that's what you are. Just like that one movie I saw where nobody was no good. I hope you guys step in a bunch of poop wherever you're running off to, anyways. Jesus Christ, this is the, the little doopy doopers a, a, a lunatic. Damn, partner, that was some quick thinking. Man, you must really hate helping people in wheelchairs. You, you got us out of that mess real quick. Damn, I thought we were never gonna get out of there. I mean, helping people move is the is the worst. They always make it seem like it'll be easy, but it never is. You know, even if it's just a couple of things. And then they offer to buy you a pizza or something. Like, like that's a fair trade. I don't think so. It's a bunch of bullshit, partner. It was pretty good moving up there, moving those boxes up there. It's a pretty good move. I hope somebody shits on their boxes. harder to find a green power baby i tell you what we wouldn't be out here getting up. surprise shit bag oh, shit. i'm killing you myself all by myself it's just come on bring it on it's gonna be me and i'm gonna kill you so good at doing puzzles did your parents make you practice morning noon and night until they ruined your love for puzzle solving leaving you to resent them all the while they're thinking that 
they were doing you a favor when in reality they were just pushing their own unhealthy addiction on you? Is that how you got into them? They're so good at puzzles? By stealing that little cup. Yeah, they came here and they thought they would get that receptacle. Nope, not because of us. We gummed it up. Yeah, we gummed that shit up. Fuck you. Fuck them, I mean. Hey, fuck you. No, no, I meant fuck them. I don't care what you said. You just said fuck you to me. No, I meant to say, I was trying to say fuck them because we don't like them. Yeah, but you said fuck you to me, man. Fucking bullshit. Hey, fuck you, man. Try to fucking apologize. Well, fuck you because you didn't apologize to me. I'm going to fucking kick your ass. No, you won't. I'll kick your ass. You're a fucking piece of shit. Get him. You're high. Good work finding that green power, baby. Uh, suck my dick. Uh, oh my god, what did I do? Oh my god. Oh no, I killed him. Oh, I killed him. Oh, I'm a murderer. I'm gonna end up on one of those murder shows on on that one channel. They're gonna cover this. I gotta I gotta bury his bones. I gotta bury his bones now. They're gonna they're gonna put me in the in the in the slammer for good. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a cold-blooded killer. What have I done? Oh my god. Oh. Oh. Oh, I'm a murderer. Oh, I'm a horrible. Oh, I'm a killer. I'm a cold-blooded killer. Oh, 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 why'd I do it? I feel remorseful about this. I feel sad about this. Why did I do this? Oh no. No. Oh, oh you fucking sons of bitches, this is all your fault. Oh, you're the reason I fuck you up. Oh, you're what the fuck? Fuck? sucks it's another stupid puzzle you know i'm sick and tired of these puzzles you know this this isn't what this isn't what it's supposed to be about you know This place. This is where lawyers are squirting reproductive sauce all over the place. Wow, man! I gotta tell you, this new ability to move shit around is really being helpful, and I'm just, I'm very impressed with you with this with with your puzzle stuff. Cause I'm glad I don't have to deal with this shit. I don't want to deal with those stupid ass puzzles. I'm glad you're doing it. All right, are you, are you working on figuring this thing out? Solving this puzzle, huh?
Man, you, I gotta give you credit for getting up here, get, getting us both up here. I think we make a pretty decent team, you know? Tina, I'm just having like a little garage sale right now, I'm trying to clean out my hut, free up some space, you know. <laughs> you interested in buying anything? Yeah, what do you got? Uh, so I got an overflowing urn filled with Big Jim's ashes. Um, I got a bag of sad chips, because when the chips are down, then you're probably eating sad chips. <laughs> oh, I also got a Power Baby upgrade. Huh, how much for the Power Baby upgrade? Interested in the power, baby, huh? I like the cut of your jib. <laughs> tell me, tell, tell you what, sir. I'll make you a deal. My pet mushroom character is over there in the middle of all those mushroom monsters. If you go rescue him, I will give you this role upgrade. But how do we know which one is your pet? I mean, they, they all look the same. Hey, don't give me that. Don't, don't you give me that nonsense. You know the difference between a pet and a monster. Come on. between a pet and a monster. Just take the power baby upgrade. You're lucky I need room for Scrappy's babies. That's right. You just made a dozen babies into orphans. I hope you're fucking happy. I hope you choke on that thing, bitch. Oh man, another upgrade for me. Another step up the old ladder. And this never gets old. I gotta tell you, these little power baby upgrades, it's, it's, it's a little bonus Jonas for me. Oh man, I can feel it coursing through my veins. Oh, oh, I feel it. Oh, 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 I feel stronger. Just press the fucking circle button. Then you can roll your ass out of my life forever. <laughs> Damn, I wanted that urn. Partner, there's no reason for us to stick around. That urn is history. It's those same two guards from before. It looks like they moved around to the back. Yeah, that's them for sure. Those jerks kept them out. Well, I'm sure this isn't going to be completely annoying with them watching us. Yeah, trying to, trying to 
From the from the front of this big fort, gonna be real fun doing this with them up there heckling us. Yeah, we're gonna heckle you all day long because you're stupid dummies. You're not gonna get into this fort. You know, there's no way. The walls are way too high. We're way up here. You know, we're gonna we're gonna kill you both. All right. Okay. Whatever. We're gonna rip you apart. This is our super secret duper fort. And you're not gonna get in here. And me and this guy are, we're, we're, we're best pals. We're best pals. Yeah, that's right, we are best pals. We're the coolest dudes in the, in the whole place. And we are not gonna let you into our super duper fort. No way, because we're good buddies. That's right, we are good buddies. You're my buddy, give me a little hug. No, 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 we shouldn't do that. We, we, we should, let's just keep it, let's just keep it professional and keep an eye on these two. We're, we're here, we're, we're, we're gonna take that vessel back that you stole from that little wheelchair character. Oh yeah, we stole that vessel. I stole it myself with my own little hands. No, I helped do it. I helped you steal that vessel from the little wheelchair guy. No, you didn't. You just stood there and looked like a lazy bum that you are. Hey, don't call me a lazy bum. I didn't, I did, I, I helped you carry the vessel over here into the fort. You didn't help me carry nothing. You got a very selective memory the way you're thinking. Hey, don't tell me about my, my memory. I got a great memory. I remember you and me in the forest. Hey, come on. I thought we said that that was our secret. All right, fine, I won't talk about it. All right, well, whatever. We're gonna get in there and we're gonna get that vessel. You're not gonna get no vessel. And you're not gonna get in here. Cause you're a bunch of stupid idiots. Yeah, that's right. You're the dumbest characters in this whole place. And we're the coolest. Darn right, we we're the coolest. Partner, we gotta figure out how to get in that fort. God, they're so dumb. Look at them. Look at how dumb they are. The dumbest things I've ever yeah. seen. Yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. Get. What are you trying to get all close for? There's no. You're not gonna get up here. You're not gonna do anything by getting all close. Yeah. What do you. What do you think? What do you think being all close to us is gonna help you get in here? I don't think so. We're gonna. Oh, look at you with the big. Picking up a big old stone. Man, those guys are driving me crazy. Anyways, what were we talking about? What do you think being all close to us is gonna help you get in here? I'll be fuck you. We're trained against blocks. We got trained against blocks. But you can't hurt us with the blocks. Yeah, we got trained against blocks. Fuck you. Anyway, uh, where was I? What do you think being all close to us is gonna help you get in here? I don't think so. We're gonna get in that fort. There's nothing you can do to stop us. You're both you're both a couple of dipshits. <laughs> yeah, you you guys are dipshits. Now, why don't you get get away from us? You're too close to us. And I don't like how close you yeah, are. I don't like how close they are to, to us right now. It's uncomfortable. I can smell them. They, they don't smell good. You guys are gonna regret oh, shit talking us when, when, when we get to you. Oh, oh, let's let's just figure out how to get in there. It so shouldn't be too hard. Anyways, what were we talking about? God, they're so dumb. Look at them. Look at how dumb they are. They dumbest things I've ever yeah, seen. Yeah, I get so angry just looking at them because they're our enemies. Yes, they are. They are our arch enemies, and we will take them out. Yeah, we will. We're gonna take them out someday. No, we're gonna do it today, not someday. We're gonna kill them today. Yeah, they're they're just the dumbest things I've ever seen. Hey, you guys aren't getting in this fort. You know, no matter what you do. Oh, oh, God, I'm scared of my little panties here. Somebody's got a stone. They picked up one of the little hinge head stones. Oh, is that one of those hinge head stones? Sure is. Look at, look at them swinging it around. What's he going to do with it? What's he going to do with that little hinge head stone? I'm shaking in my little panties and bra. Yeah, I'm shaking in my panties and bra. You're not. I am. You don't, you're not even wearing a panties and bra. You aren't either. Yeah, I am. It's the same color. It's the exact same color as my skin. And I wore it really tight for a lot of years, so it sort of created these indentations in my body shape. And now, when and then I took it off, and now the ones I'm wearing are flush with my body, so you can't really, you completely can't see it. Jeez, they will not shut the fuck up. All right, so uh, anyways, like I was saying, you could try a hundred different ways, but you're not gonna get into this fort because we are the guardians of the fort. 
we're up here and we're not messing around. Yeah, you tell him. You tell him. Yeah, I am telling him. What, what, I don't need you to tell me what to do. I'm not telling you what As a punishment. Ah, oh, alright. Dang. Okay. You count it off. Alright. Ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Okay, one. Uh, two. Uh, four. Uh, uh, oh, I threw out my bed. Hey, look, they're moving blocks. Huh, that's interesting. Uh, I don't like that they're moving those blocks. Yeah, me neither. God damn, those motherfuckers keep just shit talking. Anyways, what were we talking about? You count it off. Alright. Ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Okay, one. Uh, two. Uh, Four. Uh, uh, oh, oh, I threw out my back. Uh, I think that last jumping jack got my back. I think I threw it out. Oh, crap, are you all right? Oh, uh, uh, it hurts. It hurts. You, you know what? For throwing out my back, that's going to cost you four jumping jacks. Oh, man. Yeah, I guess you're right. I guess... I guess I do. I guess I. I guess I. I guess I did. I do deserve it. All right, you gonna count them off? Yeah, I'll count them off. Okay, ready whenever you are. All right, here we go. One, uh, two, uh, three, uh, four. Uh, oh, uh, I hurt my back now. Ah, uh, on that fourth one. Oh, uh, it got me. Oh, uh, oh, uh, you, you threw my back out. Now you gotta do four jumping jacks as a punishment. Oh man, I guess. I guess you're right. I guess it's only fair. when you are. All right, go. One, uh, two, uh, three, uh, four. Uh, oh, hey, I fixed my back. My back feels better on that last, on that last jumping jack. It's all, everything's where it needs to be. It feels good. I feel really good again. Huh, that's interesting. My back still hurts really bad. Yeah, well, you're not allowed to do any jumping jacks because you, because that's their punishment. And you just fixed my back. So you're, you're, uh, you're plumb out of luck. Yeah, I guess I'll be all, I guess I'll just have to deal with it. About with the bum back. Yeah, you know, you'll be fine. We just gotta just stay, we gotta stay close and just keep, you know, keep each other warm up here. It's breezy. Yeah, it is breezy up here. Cold up here. Yeah, it sure is. That's why we gotta keep each other warm, you know, just stay, stay close to each other. I can feel the heat of your body. I can feel the heat of your body. It's, it's good. It's a good way to keep warm. Hey, look at them going in the forest area. What do you think they're gonna find in the forest area? There's nothing in there. Yeah, I know, there's nothing in that forest area at all. I mean, we picked that thing clean. We picked that forest area clean to the bone. Yeah, we sure did. And then we made love behind the tree, remember? Hey, I thought you said you weren't ever going to talk about and tell anybody about that. Hey, listen, man, I love you. Sh hey, come on, man. We're trying to guard the thing. We don't want them to hear what we did in the forest. Oh, look, they're right by the spot where we made love. Hey, man, come on. You said you wouldn't talk about that. Hey, look, I'm just, you know, I'm just trying to... Oh, look, it's the block movers. A couple of little block movers down there. Yeah, they're like the doozers. What do we got a couple of doozers down there? Oh, look, it's the doozers. We got a couple of little doozers down there moving some blocks. Those Glorcon clones are pissing me off. Anyway, uh, where was I? Hey, did you switch shampoos? You smell really nice. Is that your shampoo? No, I haven't I, I haven't switched shampoos. I'm still using the same stuff. Huh, I wonder what that is. You smell really nice. Yeah, thank you. I mean, maybe my deodorant. You know, it could be my deodorant. 
Oh, look at, look at, somebody just learned how to stack some things on top of stuff. Welcome to the Stacky Awards. We've got a couple of stackers here. The award for stacking things together of no consequence to anyone in the entire cosmos goes to the little purple piece of shit. Oh, look who's stacking again. More things on things. What in the heavenly heck is going on here? Because that is a racist action right there. That's a racist thing to do. Wait, you stacking all that shit? Go stack things on blocks. You don't stack blocks on stuff. Oh, 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 the gates are gonna open now because we're dying. Oh, 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 Holy shit! All right, partner, we gotta we, we gotta keep a lookout for that receptacle that we need to fill with Glorcon DNA. It's gotta be around here somewhere. Damn, you found a green goddamn. Power baby, good job! Oh, these green power babies, they make my brain shiver. That's it. That's all the power babies. Okay, Jesus good. Christ, they're good. using okay, that cauldron so receptacle on, on power babies. Over here. Hey, 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 who let you in here? Get the fuck out of here. This is our secret fuck fortress. Fuck and this is our gut sucking little cauldron. Fuck you. That's our cauldron. Oh, get him. Can't fucking get me. Fuck, get him. Oh, fuck these guys. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. the guards hold on to your buckets if you know what i mean hey whoa holy shit there's a bunch of reruns of golden girls on right now out here what golden girl reruns where uh, guys come on golden girls reruns guys I'm coming i'm coming i heard it i heard it i'm coming golden girls hey wait a minute you son of a bitch get them 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 get Oh, fuck. Yeah. Oh, you, gotta, you gotta kill him close to the vessel, partner! Let's go, we gotta save him. Yeah. Wait a minute. You fucking lied to us. You goddamn right I did. Uh,
really doing this. We're pretty good together. All right, here we go. Here, let me get some more. Man, I really wish there was somebody else here that could help me finish eating this, um, candy apple I got from the state fair. Candy apple from the state fair. That was my favorite. Oh, fuck you. 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 We're killing it, partner! We're, we're fucking a good team! Holy shit! What kind of Glorcon clone is that? I'm the Shield Glorcon clone! Get the fuck out of here! Quit messing around with my other Glorcon clone friend! Quit lying to them about stuff! We, we thought you were serious! I'm the Glorcon Shield clone! Oh, fuck a piece of shit! I'm fucking murder you! Like a little bit ago? You can't fucking stop my shield, you fucking idiot! Whoa, hey, oh my god! Man, we're the fucking Shield dead. brothers! That's right, there's two of us now, now you're really fucked! Yeah, you might have been able to kill our other shield, they're fucking But now there's two of us and we're brothers! I'm gonna fuck you up! Fucking murder them! Can't get behind either of us at once! Cause there's two of us! Thank you. 
It's you again. Yeah, I stole that node locking technology from one of those chicken nuggets and I locked this node down so that I could say, I'm sorry, I want to make amends with you and I, I, I really need a favor. I want you to move me back to my original house if you have a sec. Uh, I, I wanted to live in that house with the basketball hoop, but over time that basketball hoop came to haunt me. It's always there looking at me. It's always there looking back at me. I don't even play basketball. I don't know what I was thinking. Plus that house is too close to the cliff. I just want to move back to the first home I was in. And if you move me, I'd really appreciate it. Okay, all right, take, calm down. Just relax. Partner, what, what do you want to do about this? Come on, help out old Doopy, hmm? Just go back and move my boxes, it's that simple. Please. Uh, I'm not gonna let you pass until you move me back. Please just move my house back. It's all I want in the world. Come on guys, just help me move back to my original house. I can't live in a house with a basketball hoop on it. Who am I, LeBron James? Ow, ouch. Wait, 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 don't hit me. I just need you to help me move back to the first house. Oh, good. Just meet me at the back of the house. Okay, so all I need you to do is move my boxes back to my old house. Thanks again for doing this. I know we didn't end on a good note. As soon as you left, it dawned on me that this house was not meant for me. It's the basketball hoop. I thought I would love it, but it felt like it was judging me, taunting me. Doopy, come donk me, donk me, Doopy. Plus, I was just too close to the cliff, which gave me the creeps, to be honest. Anybody could just climb up the secret staircase, look down, and see everything. I don't like that. Not to mention, if it rains, then the whole bluff could come tumbling down, burying me alive. I've always been afraid of being buried alive or being burnt alive. Thank you so much for doing this. I, I really do appreciate it. Um, there is just one more thing. No! No more things! We're not doing any more things! Either give us the green power baby or we're taking one of your boxes. All right, all right. Here's your green power baby. Jeez, some people. My God, well, who anyway, is it? Who's out now there? I can relax and watch no, some TV finally. Nobody, it's nobody. Who the fuck is at the door? Open the door. No. Why the fuck are you closing the door? Get out of my way. Get the fuck out of Nancy, my way. You need to take it easy. Is it that no, it's not your fault. I will fucking. Nancy, you got it! Take no, it easy! This is bullshit! I'm gonna get this the baby! I'm gonna get the fuck! You know what? Here. Yo, what are you gonna do? Then what? Go to your parents' house? You're gonna go to your parents' house? Dad, I will rip the fucking dad! 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 I will rip the fucking dad
Oh, oh, great. Oh, that wonderful. Wonderful. Well, why don't we call the man oh, Look at me. Look at me. Oh, That's great. Yummy. Sure. Yeah, this sure is so good. Yes, yeah, I'm me. very upset. Get on your face. I didn't face. do anything wrong. I'm yeah. trying to help you. It's yeah. all for you. Good lord, that doopy duper character. Just moving back and forth like a nutball. Like a lunatic. It's a bitch wait, 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 waste of our time, partner. We gotta. I'm really thinking we can pull this off now, you know? I mean, after that big battle and the thing. And we gotta get our. We gotta. We, we should have knocked Doopy off the cliff, to be completely frank with you. We gotta get out of here. We gotta go. We gotta hustle. I think we might be able to do this thing. We gotta move. We wasted all that time with Doopy Duper. Look, I like green power babies as much as the next little purple eye hole monster. But I'm not trying to waste a bunch of time about it. We gotta hustle. Now that we're a tight machine, we're working together, we gotta hurry up. Anyways, all right, listen, don't forget to dump off your power babies. Oh, fuck. Oh, my God. I got, th I got, a th we got a third extra hit point for me. Man, I'm getting so much more powerful. I can feel it in my blood. These green power babies are really worth collecting. Alright! All the green power babies on top of all the other shit we had to do and deal with. Doopy Duper, the fucking, the, 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 the guys on the wall, you, you, but you still got all the green power babies. Oh, good work. Hello? What's going on? Hey boss, listen! Uh, you know, we, we, we got the cauldron. You know, me, me and the chair orpian. You know, I, I'm really starting to think we might be able to pull this off. Trover, get a hold of yourself. Get your shit together. Pull your britches together. Don't don't get so uh, highfalutin think you can pull this off. Uh, chair orpian, is it true? Do you think you can pull this off? All right, good. I'm going to need that kind of gumption and confidence. Because I've got a lot of money on the line here. We're taking bets in the office at the giant space station here as to whether or not you dum dums will be able to save the cosmos. Because we are fucking wasted. All of us. Now listen, I need you two dum dums to get that stupid cauldron filled with Glorcon gut clones guts into voodoo person's place. I gotta get the fuck out of here. I got a sweaty, wet person in my office that I need to lick and hug. And that's a cultural thing, and I don't want you to be oppressing me about it. Over and out. Cultural sensitivity. You know, fuck that guy. Fuck him. He's the reason I'm in this mess. I'd be on my home planet right now, at my favorite place, Empty Peepers, sipping a sloppy flap. And I'm here with your stupid ass. Look, I'm sorry. I don't mean to call you stupid. I, I really do think we did a pretty good job back there. You know, I mean, maybe we maybe maybe we might be fit to, to figure this stuff out together as a team. We do have certainly complementary skill sets. But I'm just upset about the, my boss. I am humble. I'm a humble person. I'm humble as fuck. You know, I got a fucking Rolls Royce. I got a fucking... I, I got a giant mansion in my home place, in my home world. I, I got a... I got... I got a... I wear Rolex normally. I'm not right now. Mmm. Oh, someone just arrived. Ah, oh, welcome. I'm Voodoo Person. I'm gonna take your receptacle and enchant it with science and things. But I need a favor from you, please. Set the vessel down in front of me, please. Drop the vessel with all the Glorcon goo inside of it. Set it down in front of me. Just set the vessel down in front of me. You can do it now. It's, it's a quest drop. It's all primed and ready. Ah, oh, good work. Right where I asked you to place it. Right in the spot. Or close enough. Thank you very much. I need you to go to... There's a cursed village. The villagers' souls are tormented in everlasting pain. And they must be freed from their bodies to once again know peace. They walk the 
area of their village aimlessly, endlessly, and for eternity in pain and torment. Okay, all right, what do you want us to do? You have to go to the villagers and, and kill them, slay them, so their spirits will be freed and they can once again know peace from, from the pain and torment that they are eternally living in because they've been cursed. Partner, what do you think? All right, okay, thank you. We'll be back. All right, good luck, you two, and as, while you're gone, I'll be hard at work enchanting this vile... I can't believe we're killing these people, but I will say, at least we're getting to do it under this beautiful green sky, and the ground is sort of orangey, and the little their little houses are circular and orange. It's pretty. I mean, I do like, I do appreciate that. Hey, partner, maybe we should scope this place out before we kill anybody. You know, these villagers don't seem possessed. They, 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 they seem fairly put together. You know, partner, you know, we don't have to kill these villagers. I mean, we'll still get the enchanted cauldron and all that stuff. Titty sucking two ball bitch green power baby. It's a fuck 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 green power baby. Holy shit, it's a green power baby. kill any of them i hope voodoo person doesn't get upset i mean that's what we came here for but whatever you know you're you're calling the shots let's go back to voodoo person oh my god i can't believe it i can't believe it i got another hit point this is my fourth new hit point i'm so strong now partner i'm so strong and i feel so good oh shit y you managed to get all the green power babies here in this little cursed village smell oh i've been jibbling the little shween ever since you two left come on into the little hut you couple of hotties i'm jibbling my shween right now oh with my third arm get in here and help me jibble my shween uh voodoo person we actually didn't kill anybody any of the villagers because it just felt weird they, they, they seemed totally fine you didn't kill any of the villagers oh wow oh. Their spirits will be trapped as they meander. Oh, and their little 
rectangular shaped huts that are dark gray and the red piercing blood red sky of the world. That's what it looked like, right? When you were there, that's what you saw. No? Well, what did it look like then? Uh, it, they had orange huts and like the sky was green and the ground was sort of orangey and sandy oh like- Oh my god. Oh, I gave you the wrong coordinates. Oh, and you didn't kill anybody. Thank God. That's the village I go to get my dry cleaning done. Oh, thank God you didn't kill anybody. Or else I wouldn't even be able to get any of my dry cleaning stuff done. Okay, here's the vial of Glorcon guts. Uh, Glorcon clone guts. You take that to your... I voodooized it, and I did all a little magic to it. Now the abstainers will be able to use that, but... Thank God, they, they do my dry cleaning, they clean my house twice a week, they do my driveway, the, they do the, uh, all the landscaping. Thank God you didn't kill them. Alright, leave me the fuck alone, I'm a voodoo character, I got shit to do. Get the fuck out of my house, get out of my place, I got shit to do. I'm a voodoo character. Alright, let's go. I knew it! I knew there was something wrong about that village! I felt it in my gut! I was like, I don't know about this dude, and you were like, me too! God damn it! Can you believe this shit, partner? I mean, we could have wiped out an entire village because of that idiot voodoo person character with her, with her gaping asshole. You probably didn't see it, but when I was running around in there, I saw her gaping giant asshole. It was insane! But anyways, we could have killed the village. It's insane we didn't do it. Thank God. And now we're and now we're partners here. We're like you're you're a fucking Cherokee. I'm an eye hole monster. What the fuck is this shit? You know what I mean? We don't. We, we uh, the likes of us don't ever get along in the cosmos. But here we are, an unlikely pairing. God damn, part. We are dialed in. We're a couple of buccaneers. You know? Oh shit! What the fuck's going on? Holy shit! Surprise! It's me, Glorcon, you fucking dumb pieces of shit! Oh my god! Trying to get your dogs back? Not gonna happen. See him in my eyes? They're fucking crying right now. It hurts them to be in my eyes. You guys are fucked! Fuck trying you! Trying to get my Glorcon clone guts? Trying to fucking do one over on me? I don't think so. I'll be taking no. those. Fucking idiots! Can't believe the abstainers thought something this stupid would work. I'm a fucking god with your dogs in my eyes. I'll be right back. I've got a little surprise for you. Oh, while I'm away, look at the beautiful vista of my amazing Glorcon Palace base behind an incredibly powerful shield force field. I intercepted your pod and placed you in a nice spot with good view of my fucking cool base of operations on this secret hidden planet. I'll be right back. Holy shit, partner! What the fuck are we supposed to do? Surprise! A little present for you oh, guys. What the fuck? You know what it is? It's a fucking bomb! Jesus Christ! the second you arrive at the abstainer's location, it's gonna detonate. And it's gonna kill the three abstainers along with the two of you. Suck my giant Glorcon nuts, you fucking dipshits. Holy shit! Shit, partner, you gotta defuse that bomb. Defuse the bomb. Just do whatever, like hit buttons or figure it out. Uh, I, I, gotta, I gotta reroute the telepod. I gotta override the telepod. He's got us going straight for the abstainers. It's gonna kill the abstainers and, and you and me. Holy shit, it looks just like that damn puzzle from the tree trunk in the Shlemy world, the first level of the game. The fucking impossible puzzle. I thought we weren't gonna do that in this game. I thought I thought we agreed we weren't gonna do those sorts of game mechanics in this game. That's not what this game's about. Jesus Christ. Why would they put another one of these in the game? It's not the fun thing to do in a game. It's not a fun thing to do in a video game. So you hit buttons. It's like a quick time event. Yeah, oh, hello, Dragon Slayer from 1985 called. It wants its fucking lame quick time event bullshit. Whatever, who cares? Uh, I got it, I got it. The telepod doors are open. Fuck this bomb. Fuck this shit. I'm fucking this. I'm kicking it out. One, two, and a three. Right out the fucking telepod door. Look at that fucking thing flying away. I overestimated this Glorcon character. Or maybe I didn't, but whatever. Either way. I'm pretty cemented on the fact that this guy's a fucking moron! Trova, Cherokee, what happened? Glorcon intercepted the telepod, somehow brought us to his secret base, and, and then he put a bomb in the telepod, but get this! It was the world's shittiest fucking bomb! 
You know, it was a fucking piece of shit, you know what I mean? But I, but his intentions were to kill, you know, all of us. You know, me, the, the Cherorpion, the three of you. We were all supposed to die. I'm, I'm, I mean, that, that, that much is clear to me. But he's a fucking idiot and he, and he fucking fucked up because he's stupid. And that, that makes me feel pretty good and comfortable and relaxed. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness gracious. He's past the point of reasoning. He's gone mad. If Glorcon redirected the telepod to his secret base, then that means the telepod has Glorcon's secret base location embedded into it. And we can determine where his secret base is. Trover, Cherorpion, we must engage in a reconnect. It's a very risky and untested maneuver. No one knows exactly what happens when four abstainers get manually reconnected, but one thing is for sure. It will probably strip Glorcon of his agency and almost definitely fold his consciousness back into ours. Most likely. That sounds like some sort of plan. Here are special grab throw chair upgrade things. Spit on them. Ready? Three, two, one. <laughs> Normally I'm into getting spit on. You know, it's kind of a turn on, but not by these guys, you know? Not too much of a fan of that. All right, you've just been endowed with the grab throw chair upgrade. It lets you grab and throw objects wherever you look. Where was this when Glorcon had a bomb strapped to our telepod? Shut your bitch ass up, Trover, before we smack you across the face backhanded, like pimps do. That's right, we know about pimps. We are summoning four strange creatures. Here they are. These creatures are special. They're the crystallized, large creatures. We only have four. You will need to go and find four more. But for now, I want you to pick these up and throw them into two of our eye holes, connecting two of us. Cherorpion, you must look at the crystal power, baby, and hold the button to activate this new ability. Do it. Pick them up and throw the creatures into two of our eye holes. Oh, good work. You're a real plugger. I, I will prefer to wait for the other crystal power babies that you're gonna find in the levels. Oh shit, almost. Try again. Oh, oh, I want the crystal power babies in my eyes. Do me now. We are now merged. We feel very good. This is very nice. I feel very zen. You must go out and collect four more of the other special creatures. They will need to be plugged into this abstainer. What's up, dudes? It's me, Tyler. And Glorcon. Go now, go, go get the other special creatures. Go, hurry. Come on, all right, partner, let, let, let's, let, let's leave them to it. Oh, oh, I'm, I'm, I'm all messed up back here. I, I'm all loopy as hell. Glorcon's one hell of a Villain. Oh, I don't like the way this place looks. I'm thinking I might need to do some rearranging of this place. I'm loopy as hell. Oh, I'm all messed up from not being Jesus Christ, from those that creatures. one abstainer's all fucked up. Yeah, Listen to him. Kinda makes me want to get drunk. I say we get I'm drunk, partner. I say we get real drunk. Show. Once we finish all this oh, shit, no, I say we take up. a shot oh, every man. level. Ooh, yeah. Oh, I feel all tingly. I'm so high. I feel high Carter, that's hell. the boss calling. Oh, Go ahead and man. answer. Hello, Trover, Cherorpion. You have to collect these special creatures, the crystally ones, that need to be plugged into the abstainer and Glorcon's eye holes. I found the location of a pair of them. They're in Flesh World. Flesh World. What is Flesh World? Well, could be any number of things. I, I truly have no idea. And I, it's not my job to know that. I don't give a shit. All I know is the computer I looked at located the crystal babies and they're in flesh world and I'm gonna make sure the telepod gets you right near where they are so you get out of the telepod on flesh world and you fucking get the crystal babies and let's just keep this horse moving now let's talk a little bit about flesh world what is it is it flesh is it a world why not call it skin world why not call it skin planet I don't know it's not my job to name things I'm the boss of this operation. Okay? Now get the fuck out of my sight. I got shit to do. Fucking. I got a homework assignment. I'm doing a crossword puzzle for my for my teacher. I'm taking a night school class. See you guys in Flesh World. Or I won't be there, but you know what I mean. Good luck in Flesh World.
Man, I am just reeling at how stupid this Glorcon character is, you know? Thinks he's all tough. He might have your dogs plugged into his eyes and have superpowers, but I'll tell you one superpower he doesn't have. The, the superpower of intelligence. He's an idiot. That was the dumbest bomb I've ever seen in my life earlier that he tried to pull. Didn't do nothing. Now all we gotta do is find these crystal babies, and we'll be wrapped- well, This whole thing will be wrapped up real quick, and you'll be back home on your stupid chair place, and I'll be in my place. And we'll have distant memories of each other. Right, partner? You and me. Distant memories. Jesus Christ, this fucking place looks like a cannibal's paradise, you know what I mean? Hey, the, the, the source material you guys are made from is a fucking moron! You're all dumb! Fucking guys. Alright, partner, let's get inside this place and get that get these fucking crystal babies. Hey purple guy and Cheropian. I've heard of Cheropian. Come over here. Free power, baby. Hey, seriously, come over here. Man, this place, you know, it's it's Green Power, baby! There is stupid. Where you are is dumb. Come here. Come here now. Partner, this looks like that upgrade guy from, uh, from earlier. Let's go see what he wants. Hey, you two, come over here. Hey, partner, what do you think of this crazy thing, huh? Should climb up on top of that thing and give it a, give it a ride around the, around this... Green power, baby! Over here! Come here! Hey, partner, let's go see what this guy wants. Here! 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 Over here, get over here. I'm serious. Over here. You know, rumor has it that if you turn this world inside out, it looks like a 45 year old bank teller. Here. No, here. Here. Uh, I don't know how we're getting in here. It looks locked to me. Jeez, this place smells like raw chicken that was left in the trunk of a car. H E. A R, get over here. Are you, are you hard oh, of hearing? Oh, green power me. Smells like an abandoned retirement home where a bunch of old people died and started to decompose. Hey, you two, I was gonna say something to you, but I forgot it. I wanna tell you guys some things. I've got a lot of hot info that you need right now. Get over here. Hey, partner, come on, let's go check out what this guy wants. I've got things I want to say to you. I'm tired of yelling. Get over here. Can you guys even hear me? Hello? Hello? Can yeah, you it's hear me? Look, man, I'm not going to say something over cute here. and clever every time you, you see two. something. Let's just yeah. get a freaking move one. on. Oh my god, what if nobody could hear me? I can hear me. Can you guys hear me? You two guys. Oh, oh, hey, what's going on, bro? I'm Upgrade Teddy. You're waiting for the zoo to open, too? That place ain't right. My baby bro went in there last week, and he never returned. I just hope he didn't forget his heart medication. Is it Boraleg? You heard of it? It's the brand doctors trust most of the time. Speaking of time, I've been out here so damn long that I built this game. Want to give it a go? Here, you're going to need this power baby upgrade. Oh shit, we got a power baby upgrade, partner. Let's get this puppy installed in me. Yeah, come on, bro. It's free. Take it. Come on, grab the... Man, look at these little sons of bitches going at it. Oh my god, this is incredible. You know, if they put this on a sports network, I would watch it. I'd bet money on it. All right, you got the power baby upgrade. It's all installed. Now just hit the button for a new heavy, sweet-ass attack move. I've been out here for so long, all I can do is build this stupid game. It's simple! Knock the bug in the air, look at the little dude. Ha-ha! 
There you go. Got it. Hit all the targets and I'll hit you with a prize. I think my brother's dead. The zoo's been closed ever since that big-ass spaceship showed up. Some big, muscly stud muffins locked it up. They have that dumb, sexy He-Man look to them, you know? But who All right, nice one. I don't know what's going on. I've just been waiting for the zoo to fucking open so I could get my brother out. It's nice to see you guys are playing my game. It looks fun. I haven't even played it. And you missed it. Sure is a beautiful day for standing around watching somebody not accomplish shit. Hey, did I ever tell you... Hey, look at that. You got them all. You get a free green power baby. Oh, don't you worry about me and those these green power babies. I'm gonna take care of those. But first, we gotta get inside this zoo. How are you gonna get in? It's all locked up, stupid dumb. You think this is my first time breaking into a zoo, huh? I break into zoos all the time. I just broke into a zoo last week. Why? For the same reason I do everything. Criskets. I know they got criskets in there. Uh, and I'm ready to get back on that horse. Oh, man. I had to stop eating those. They kept making me pee blood. I don't know if you guys know what it's like to stand on a pile of sweaty flesh all day, but that's what I've been doing. And I'd describe it to you, but I just sort of did. Oh, just standing around a pile of sweaty flesh all day. What a treat. Holy shit, Fart. You opened the gate. Look at my baby bro. Downgrade Donnie. Yeah, we'll be sure to keep an eye out for him. I'm gonna take my pee pee blood and put it in a vial and give it to a doctor. <laughs> you guys didn't need to know that there's blood coming out of my pee pee hole right now. There's a pile of pee pee blood by my feet. Don't look down. Do you got a bathroom in your telepod? I really need to go number two, but I can't do it with all the blinking eyes and skin everywhere. I wasn't planning on being out here so long. I hope my neighbor is still collecting my mail. It's almost tax time. Nice with those new power babies in your eyes. Uh, yeah, what? thanks. But, but, what, what have you been up to, Gale? What does it look like I've been up to, Trover? I'm the head zookeeper of my own goddamn zoo. That's right. I'm keeping this zoo all by myself. And it's my fucking zoo. What have you been up to? Slumming it with a Cherorpion, I see. So what are you, Trover's new roommate? I'm talking to you, Cherorpion. Are you his new roommate? Yes or no? You know the system. Yes or Oh, well, good for you. You got off scot-free in that case. Because this little son of a bitch will stick you with last month's rent, all the stains on the wall for the cleaning deposit, and a bunch of other things. It doesn't take five nails to hang one picture, Trover. Listen... Yeah, we're just here to see the crystal babies. Oh, you want to see the crystal babies? Well, go by all means on your own little way and find them. I'm sure you couldn't help but notice that the gate to the flesh safari is closed. But I'm not going to help you, Trover. If you were any other one of my zoo guests, I'd give you a lift. But guess what? 
Fuck you. Now let me get back to what I was doing a second ago. I was counting papers. Thanks, Gale. What? Okay, partner, let's figure out how to get this fucking flesh safari door open. Huh, I wonder why this gate's locked. What's going on here? Fuck you, Trover. Leave the fucking gate alone. That's my new roommate's gate. Okay, Gale. I didn't know you were paying attention to us. Sorry. You got damn right I'm paying attention to you, Trover. Now back to my little zoo-keeping tax work I gotta deal with. So fuck you. Jesus Christ, I can't believe it's fucking my old roommate, Gale. I mean, sure, yeah, I ditched out on some of the rent money, but the guy's fucking insane, I'm telling you. He used to come into my bedroom and just scream about lasagna for no reason. He was, like, in a trance. I couldn't even talk to him. This is not good. We gotta get these fucking crystal babies and get the fuck out of here. Partner, I'm telling you, this guy's fucking insane. One time he threw a party, said all his best friends were gonna be there. I came out of my room and I talked to people. Nobody knew who he was. I don't know where he found these people. I got the fuck out of there. Oh God, one time Gail brought home a random baby. He didn't even know who it belonged to. I put it in the sink. I just took off. He claimed that the stock photos in his picture frames were people that he sued. He would leave notes everywhere, and they weren't even to me. They were to non-existent people about things that had happened in the apartment that didn't happen. He starts screaming about pizza nuggets, which doesn't make any sense because his father was a pizza nugget. Oh, wait a minute. Maybe, maybe there is a connection and that doesn't make sense. We gotta get the fuck out of here. Drinking his water, he used to eat it, if you know what I mean. And I'm not even talking about that he froze it and fucking chewed on it. I'm saying he would use a fork and a knife and eat water. Unfrozen liquid water. That's who we're dealing with here. my shingle on his pillow and the guy never washed the pillow you'd wash your pillow if you caught someone rubbing their shingle on it the guy's nuts once saw him use the bathroom and I set up four cameras on the bathroom just to be 100% sure. Never went in there. His room, on the other hand, spent a lot of time in that room. And there were piles of green sludge in there. A lot of green sludge. He used to sleep on a bed of rocks and pipes that he found in the sewer. Sucking these little sons of bitches up! Oh! 
one time I came home and I saw him standing there rubbing raw turkey dough all over his ass. Who does that? Did it, partner. Good work. Good work, Trover and Chiropian, opening my zoo park door. And I have fun. And have a good time. And I hope you find my crystal babies and get a good peep at them. This zoo isn't easy to open. Is isn't easy to keep open. I'm back to my taxes. All right, Gail. Sorry. Let's go. Come on. We gotta move. Cut it out, Trover. You can't hit my little creature. This isn't our old apartment. But you can just... Ooh, you are sucking these green power babies up. You know, Gail, I gotta say, you sound a lot like one of these characters we met called the Abstainers. The Abstainers? Yeah. Oh. Let's get our little grid graph paper out and figure out this mystery. Who, how could this be that I sound somewhat similar to one of the Abstainers? What mystery is afoot? I think it might be low budgets, crunching, and the fact that it's difficult to make a video game, Trover. And it's not easy to do creative endeavors when you have 10,000 different actors and you're rewriting the thing every 10 seconds. And it's still gonna turn out pretty shitty. So why don't you get the fuck out of my face, Trover? We're trying to make a fucking video game here. I'm telling you, partner, I'm getting weird vibes about this place, you know? We should hurry up and get the crystal babies and get the hell out of here. Prison Bay! Come closer and I'll refresh your mouth. I'm gonna make a three course meal out of that ass. prison. I don't belong here. I'm innocent. They're claiming that I killed my maid, but I didn't. She just, uh, she just died. Alright, so this is definitely a prison. This is just great. Hey, you shut the hell up, purple man. Uh, please, I'm in, I'm in desperate need of a lawyer. Can you help me? Do you know of any lawyers? So do you know any? Thank you. I, I really hope he's good because, man, I look guilty as fuck. <laughs> I was just like, I'm seen with that with the weapon right in my hand, but I bet no. I, but I, I did not do it though. I, honest to God, I killed her. I killed her with a shoot shoe rack. Ugh. See, this is what I mean. I just, I just the word died. I, did, I mean, I didn't kill her with the sh shoe rack. I didn't kill her at all. Oh, fuck. This is, this is like my trail all over again. Whatever. Just, 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 just go. You just go and find your lawyer friend. All right. Just go and find your lawyer friend. Go. Go! What are you waiting for? Go call him! I need a lawyer with a southern accent, cause I'll... Go, go, 
hurry, hurry, hurry. Man, you're a goddamn green power baby machine. Hey, stranger. Oh. My name is Andy DeFrance, and I've been wrongfully accused of murder. You have to help me. No, listen, I'm sorry, but, you know, we're, we're busy. Fine. I don't need you. I'll escape by crawling through the sewage system. I'm talking three football fields of shit. Ugh, that's disgusting. Yeah, it's gonna get real nasty up in there, splashing around in other people's shit and piss. Mm, I might even get a little bit in my mouth. Oh my god! I'm talking 900 feet of pure dark back magic. Coursing through every inch of my naked body. The ultimate poop pinata. Ugh. With me. Oh, you're taking off. Okay, bye. People who reads those, like, can you find it books? Where's Waldo books? You got a keen eye for these green power babies! You really have a keen eye for these green power babies! Look at me over here. Hey, hey, come on. Come on, look over here. Psst. Hey, hey, come here. You gotta help me out. I shouldn't be here. I'm innocent. I didn't steal all those rakes. They said I stole a thousand rakes. Motherfucker, I don't even know what a rake is. Okay, let's keep going. Shut the fuck up, you purple bag of pus. I'm talking to the chair, Opie. Do you believe I'm innocent? Tell me that you believe me. I need to know that you believe me. Tell me what you believe. Tell me that you believe me. Yes or no? Do you believe me? Oh, thank God. Look, I know your people hold a lot of sway with the Intergalactic Space Federation. They're locking us up without due process. You gotta talk to them. What are you waiting for? Go talk to them. Hurry, go! Get me out of here. Get me out of this prison.
I'll stop. I'm just, just go, just get a chat. Just go find him before I say something weird. Pissy shit piss. And poop and poo poo and pee and brown bad poop and yellow piss and shit. Poo poo pee. I want all the poop and pee on me and in me. And I'll eat the shit and eat my shit after I eat that shit. And I'll poop and pee and shit and eat the shit in your and your poop and your pee and poop it out and I want all the shit and piss in the world and the poop. Flush your poop and shit and piss and piss and shit. Yellow or brown or clear piss, it doesn't matter. I want all the shitty corn, solid, soft poop. Soft serve, hard brown. Pissy shit piss and poop and... I'm gonna knit a sweater out of your intestines, ow, motherfucker! Ow, 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 ow. You know, every time I'm I die in the game, a, a person dies in real life. Dead body and then watch sports. Come here, sweet stuff. Hey, mm, looking good.
fine. Pissy shit piss and poop and poo poo and. Wow, I, what a beautiful lake! Huh, I wonder what that green stuff is. Probably better not to find out. sure that's the exhibit right up ahead that's gonna have one of those crystal creatures that we need in it get the crystal creature get the hell out of here you know oh fuck there's no way I can make it over there partner you for how oh, many years? Wonderful. Here we go. Here we go. You skipped out of my $240 rent and uh, whatever bill, and I'm angry with you. So I got in bed with these chicken nugget characters that I barely oh, know. Oh, those fucking guys. That's right. Gail's in bed with us. Uh, it's Gail. Gail, sorry. Gail's in bed with us, and you're fucked. Remember us? Yeah, fuck you. We're gonna fucking kill your fucking stupid ass. We have amazing trained ninja level clone people now. What the fuck have we gotten ourselves into? You got yourself into a real shit pile of fuck. We're sending our toughest karate chop clone fighters in now. Oh fuck, partner. We gotta deal with this head on. That's right, Trover. You gotta deal with this head on. Cause you're a fucking naked little purple survival monster. And you fucked me for... $740, and I won't ever forget it, and I, and god damn it's a coincidence, or was it? Is it a coincidence, or is it fate that brought us back together, Trover? Because I was sitting here running my zoo, that's all, that's also where I live in, and all my little zoo animals, it's not a prison, and then all of a sudden these chicken nugget characters showed up, and they said, we need help, and I said, what are you talking about? And they said, well, there's this character named Trover and, the, and this Cherubian. And they're showing up to get those crystal babies that you cared so much about. And I was like, what are you talking about? What are you talking about? Oh, wonderful. Here we go. Here we go. What are you talking about? What are you talking about? They're gonna get my crystal babies, and they told me that you said you would get them. And we teamed up and made a forest full of steam. And we will, we, and you will, you are dead. You're gonna die. That's right, you're fucked. We're gonna fucking kill you. We're gonna fucking murder you, and this is it. This is the fucking game over situation right here. You're fucking dead and dying tonight. Fuck you. Fucker. Today, I mean, it's, is it not night? It's not fucking daytime here right now. Well, it's night where we live. Well, fuck you. Maybe you don't know that Trover used to shit in my mouth when I slept at night. You wanted me to, you made me to! What are you talking about? Oh, my little slunger is hard. Oh, you know about this. Oh, I'm a puke. Under the pen name, Shutter B. Shungle. He wrote the romance novel, A Game to Dingle With. What are you- you're making stuff up again! What- what are you talking about? Oh, Lord, oh, my God, God. Oh, AIDS, AIDS, AIDS come, 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 AIDS
that's horrible. See, chair up in the corner. That's why they're the bad guys. He tried to make an instructive dancing track video VHS tape called Doing the Funky Donkey in the Middle of Our Living Room. I didn't do that. What the fuck are you talking about, Gail? What? I signed a contract with you two. You specifically said you'd kill Trover and the Cherokee. Fuck you. I guess we're gonna have to go down and deal with this. I'll go first. All right, you go first. God damn it! Shut the fuck up, Gail. Fuck you. What the fuck is wrong with those guys? some of my armor. It's not fair. You're not gonna get the power babies. There's no way we're gonna let you catch these power Trevor, babies. you know that just because you might be persevering doesn't mean that you're not a cherist. What? What are you talking about, Gail? You always said chair audience couldn't flip around. And that's why they'd never be in gymnasticals in the super special gymnast alien special Olympics. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I would never. Whoa, easy. There's the truth and then there's other stuff. Trevor, you son of a bitch. Good thing I made for a blackout plan. I'm gonna squirt out a bunch of little cute up here, and they're gonna kill you. Just because those chicken nugget people couldn't do it doesn't mean I can't, Trover. You're fucked. Initiate little tiny cube monsters. Shields down, cube creatures go. That's it, that's all you've got, Gil? I'll get that $720, Trover. If it's the last thing I do, oh, oh, you knock my cubes down, Trover, you're a fucking cherished racist, oh, you're a racist, oh. What are you doing? What are you, why are you screaming, Gail? Uh, because, because I'm, I'm, I'm defeated, you're gonna knock these cubes down, oh, 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 you're gonna knock my screen cubes down, oh. Are you? Are you underground somewhere? Oh, fuck you. I'm not gonna tell you where I am. Oh, 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 fuck. Oh, Jesus Christ. Fuck our Lord and Savior. Oh, our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Fuck. Oh. What are you talking about, Gail? You're an alien. Jesus Christ, where'd you hear that from? That's not very alien of you, Gail. Oh, fuck, go. Oh, AIDS come, AIDS come, AIDS come. Oh, fuck, that's my mantra for transcendental meditation. Oh, AIDS come, AIDS come. I'm not supposed to tell anybody that. That's so supposed to be a secret. Oh, 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 as soon as you tell somebody your mantra from transcendental meditation, it disappears. Oh, I paid $5,000 for that class. Oh, oh, oh. Gail, would you oh, shut up? Jesus Christ, the fucking gossip mongerist. I mean, I mean, all the shit he was saying, you know, all bullshit, you know? One of the most offensive things I, I heard, aside from all the AIDS cum stuff, was that he was calling me a chairist. I'm not a chairist. I mean, one of my best friends was a chair orpian, you know? Uh, you believe me, right, partner? Oh yeah? My cousin's married to a chair orpian. To be fair, I met him once at a weird family gathering that I didn't want to go to, but you know, they were fine and, and they were married to my cousin. So I'm related to a chair orpian. So now who's who's cherished now? Who's a fucking cherished now?
you know, we're buddies and we're and we're friends and we're partners. Let, let, let's 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 get a move on. Let's get a hustle on. We gotta get these fucking crystal babies. And then uh, I don't want to be I don't want to be around you after that. to get this one. Racist against Cherokees, you know. G Gail's racist against everybody. Of course, a racist would call another person a racist. He's racist against the Carptorians. He used to say that they all had the biggest teeth he ever saw, and I was like, "What the fuck are you talking about, Gail? That's super racist." And he's like, "Those Carptorians' teeth are so." Big. Those Carptorian's teeth are so big. big that one of them shoved right up my ass. That's what he said. So I'm not the racist one, you know? I mean, I'm obviously Gale is, so I don't know what the fuck he's talking about. Anyways, why are we even talking about this? Look, you're, we're friends. We're, we're, we're... Hey, there's the crystal baby. Straight ahead, 12 o'clock. Let's grab it. So find the other one and get the hell out of here. Shit, that thing just ate the crystal baby! He, he's trying to eat it! Well, hey, nice one, partner! Nice shot, partner! Holy shit, partner! Nice shot! Yes! You did it! That's what I'm talking about, partner! Alright, now let's go find the other crystal baby and get the F out of here! Nice nip flick! We should keep our eyes peeled for more of these little green nips to flick, you know? This is Nip Flip City! You've stolen one of my crystal babies. Well, a lot of good that's gonna do you because you're stuck in here with me Because I locked this place up tighter than a little dog. It's by the way if your intention is to get the second crystal baby Good luck doing that because it's in the my roommate's spot My new roommate who would who who's a good person who would never do it you you son of a bitch I wasn't done talking. I wasn't done talking
I think we might actually be trapped in here forever. I don't know what the fuck we're gonna do, but we gotta get that other power baby. So the first thing we gotta do is figure out how to get out of this space and get to another space. Holy shit, you did it, partner. You opened the door. Let's go. I thought you were gonna fucking get, do something, but you're not gonna do anything right now today. Get him. Oh. A team building seminar. Now we're invincible. I caught somebody. One Horcon clone fell back and I caught him. And that's trust. That's what you call trust. We trust each other. Us clones trust each other. You can't spell trust without us. That's what we learned in the seminar. When you destroyed our encampment in that other world, we had a seminar about trust. We lifted a Glorcon clone above our heads as a group. Because that's trust. Son of a bitch. My old roommate, Mr. Liar McLionson. Guy lies about everything. I don't, all the shit he said is a lie. Let's figure out how to get into the roommate spot. Crystal baby, get the fuck out of here! Is anyone out? 
Please, if you can hear me, I'm so hungry! Uh, that's I'm it, so motherfucker. Hungry, I could Get him. I'm gonna fuck you Hello? up, punk. Is there anyone out? I'm gonna fuck you up, punk. Oh. Hello? Is anyone out there? Please, if you can hear me, I'm so hungry. I'm getting weak. Wow, you really worked to get this one. Good on you. I can barely walk. My knees feel like oh, I'm gonna fuck you up, Please, you, you can hear me. I'm so hungry. I'm hungry. Oh I'm my god. I'm so very, very hungry. Fuck you oh, I can eat my own weapons. Please, someone help me. I'm dying of starvation. Anyone? Fuck kill someone, him. please? Food. I need fucking food. I'm so Whoa, hungry. Whoa, hey, look. A butthole oh just opened! God, that's a whole giant food. butthole that just opened! We can- That's I'm a so loose hungry. butthole! Let's go in there! Urine. I'm so hungry! I could eat my mom! Oh, I'm so weak! I need food! I can't- I can't! Food! Please, someone! I need food! I'm dying. I'm really dying. I- I'm fucking dying here. Oh! For a this is Gail's treat. roommate? Jesus I'm Christ! Really go for a tasty I, I don't treat know, right I think now. I was a better roommate than this weirdo! Listen, sunshine! Brenner, I wonder if this guy's got a crystal baby! Smart. Oh my god! Food is what I need! Oh, 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 where's my goddamn food? Oh my god, it's people! Holy shit, you guys gotta get the fuck out of here quick! The guy who runs this place is insane! Relax, dude! We know! We just- No! Don't you relax, dude me! You don't get it! I used to be the same size as you, but look what they did to me! I'm a monster! I came here because I thought it was a zoo, but it's not! Yeah, I know! We, but, we just- But I've been trapped in here for ten years. I, that's a decade. Look at me! I'm so hungry and fat and horny. Oh my god, please! Please, you have to feed me! Feed me! Man, I, I feel bad for this guy. We we gotta help him out, partner. Please? All I want is some yellow num-nums. I'm sure you're probably thinking, how could this guy be hungry? But the god honest truth is, I haven't eaten in days and I crave the taste of yellow nummy nums. Oh, so much. There's a nipple button right there. If you press it, some food will come out. I'm lactating. The yellow ones taste like dainty little lemon scrumples. Ooh, I just came. Have you ever had one? You know what, this green power baby They're was delicious. easy to get to. Thank you, I'm proud of you. Man, this guy really loves food, huh? My papa used to make them for me when I was a good titty witty booby boy. Partner, I think the guy's feeder switch is right next to him. That's correct. Just to the right of me. Partner, the the nipple button thing is right next to him. Yeah, he would come home from his job as a door. That's the yellow nummy. That's the one I want. I want it. Mm -hmm. Oh. Oh, num num num. Oh, it's so good. It's so freaking good. Oh. Mm. No, I want a blue one. I don't want that one. Oh. Mm. <laughs> oh boy. Oh my god, thank you so much. You do not know how hungry I was. Oh. Hey, no, that's not what I'm asking for. Listen to me, I want a blue one. Uh, hey, like I was saying. Oh, I love the blue num num. It puts yellow to shame. I love the fuck out of the num nums that are blue. Come on, man, we don't have time for this. We need to find the other crystal baby. Crystal baby? Why, the crystal baby exhibit is right behind me. God damn it, of course it is. I thought maybe you were sitting on it or something. Tell you what, you toss me one more tasty treat and I'll roll right out of your way. Come on, toss me a tasty blue treat. Come on, man. Are you dense? The blue feeder is right over there. Way up there, over there to the left. That's the blue feeder. What are you, like a wing nut? You gotta go up and get the blue num nums. It comes out of the blue feet. Way over there. Over there. There! Come on, please! Uh, way over there to the left. You see it? That's my blue feeder. 
That's the feeder I'm talking about that's blue. Uh, all right, fine. Great, and make sure it's a blue one, okay? Not another color other than blue. I swear to God, I usually never eat like this. I used to be in such great shape. I could run. I even had my own workout video. Bartholomew's ball busting buff bod and beach buns. And let me tell you, I would kick the little push right into shape. Whoa! Yeah, whatever, dude. It would. Let me ask you something. Are you happy with the way you look? Are you? <sighs> how dare you body shame me? I don't need you telling me how I should look. My flaws are what makes me flawless. My mistakes are my achievements. <laughs> All I did was ask you the same question you asked me! Man, I hate those little bastards. Sure showed them, though. They'll teach them a lesson. Hope they brought in hell. Okay, this was a tough little green power baby to get, and you pulled it off. Good work. This is killing me, partner. I can't stand this. Find the blue feeder switch thing. He said it was up here to his left. Chewy, chewy, y'all. Yeah, that's great. No one cares. Now get the hell out of my no, way. Are you stupid? I said I want to grub. Yeah, that's great. No one cares. Now get the hell out of my way. I will. I swear I will. Just as soon as you toss that little juicy bug down there, right into my mouth. Oh, that's sick. You want to eat those too? What? In some countries, it's considered a delicacy, and you want to know why? Because these little suckers are to die for. I like to bite off their heads, and I suck their insides while I slurp on their outsides. Oh, my God. I really think this guy's starting to lose it, partner. Shut up, you purple pile of pus, and put that plumpy plumper on my plopper. That's a worm. Oh, that's good stuff. Oh. 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 <clears> hmm. <throat> How come it tastes so good, yet I feel so bad? I want yellow! This still ain't enough. Papa Boy needs to eat. Go to that cliff, the one in front of me. That's where you can activate my num num maker. Jesus, how big is this guy gonna get? Aren't you full already? Good lord, can you just give us the crystal baby? Shut up and feed me. All right, fine, fine, but this better be worth our time. You better not be jerking us around. Whoa! All right, here we are. Hurry, I can't take it anymore. I need more. Okay, that made like, me the numbs. Oh shit, look at that. A, a, a little, another button. I, I can get it. Drop me down yeah, there and I'll hit the yellow nummy. I want a yellow one. Oh, 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 oh. That felt real stretchy. Oh, I'm still Christ, Gail's roommate ate the crystal baby? Well, I wouldn't have ever done that, so I clearly was a better roommate than this character ever could have been. Even though we realized he's not actually his roommate and was clearly trapped here against his will. Well, I hope you're happy. You ruined my zoo, you stole my crystal babies, and you killed my the best roommate I ever had. You may as well have just shit in my mouth and stuck a twig between my little bags. Because that's how I feel. The front gates are open, Trover. I'm sorry, Gail, but the entire cosmos is at stake. Oh, 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 woe is me. The cosmos is at stake.
time you do that. like a dead hooker's mouth in here. Hey, you guys. Huh? Yeah, you two over here. But look over here. I'm in the prison cell. Holy shit, partner. Is that Donnie, the upgrade teddy guy's hey, dude, brother? So oh, crap, partner. Where are you? I can't see anything. It's, it's pitch black in here. I can barely breathe in here. What the hell are you running me around for? I'm running out of oxygen in here. I can barely breathe in here. You gotta get me out! It's like, a, it's like a wet Rusty Robbins in here! Have you ever eaten at Rusty Robbins? That's what it's like in here! You can look for a switch or some sort of nipple out there! Look for one of those tasty little green nips to whip! Loving oxygen. I'm down great, Donnie. Holy shit. I, hey, we know you. I, I mean, we know your brother, Teddy. Oh, great jobs. Please, you gotta get me out of here. They arrested me for downgrading someone, but it's not my fault. I'm down great, Donnie. It's what I do. Donnie, listen to me really carefully. Do you have your I think I'm having a heart attack. Oh, oh shit, God. he's dying! Donnie! Donnie! Oh shit, he's he's dead! Oh shit, you got an achievement! That makes it all worth it! I know what that button does. It opens up that door in this jail cell. God, I can't wait to be free and breathe the fresh air, feel the warmth of the sun. I'm gonna hop on my hog and just fucking go, man. I'm just gonna go. Just me and the open road, the wind blowing through my hair with all the kids. I think it's good to be free. Well, aren't you gonna go? Nah, but it's good to know that I can. Well, on that note, can we please get out of here? We gotta move the fuck out of here. A squirrel must have buried this one away. I was so caught up in the moment, I didn't even realize what we were doing. You know, we, we, we just force fed someone to death. It's what he wanted though, right? I mean, he died doing what he loves. Hey, you two, come over here. Huh? Oh, 
Holy shit, I didn't think you guys would make it. Did you find Donnie? Did you find my baby bro? Hey, dude, what's up? Yeah, no, we, we found your baby bro in there, for sure. Why isn't he here? Is he okay? No, listen, I, don't freak out, all right? But he died, okay? He died. He, he He's fucking dead, man. We're all gonna fucking die. No, you bastards! How could you? Everyone in my life is dying. Everyone, including you guys, eventually, and me. Death, it's a part of life. Give it a try. Hey, whoa, man, don't put that kind of stuff on us. He never even got to wear his orgasm donor t-shirt. Why? Hey, partner, let's get out of here before we have to give our condolences. I can't believe my fucking brother's dead. He was the well, one that was a stupid family fucking family level. Together. Remind me never to come back here again. <laughs> All right, listen, don't forget to dump off your power babies. <laughs> oh, man, I don't even know what to say. I, I didn't write a speech. I want to thank you, partner, for getting me my fifth hit point and making me even stronger against enemies. And uh, and I want to thank Lou Schneiveler, uh, my agent, and uh, and I want to thank, uh, you know, everybody else who, who was there for me in my life. Good night. I can't believe it, partner. You got all the green power babies, despite the fact that we were dealing with my fucking weird old roommate and we were trapped in this bizarre flesh zoo slash prison. I love you, partner. I fucking love you. You got all the green power babies on this level. Trover, Chair Orpian, tell me you got some good news. Don't let me down. Good news, boss. We got all the crystal babies. Well, tickle my pickle green. If someone had told me that a burnout eye hole monster and a dirty Chair Orpian would be the ones to save the universe. Excuse me, you know what, boss? I gotta tell you, I really don't like you talking about my partner that way. Why is that, Trover? You do it all the time. You little piece of shit. What? No, no, I, no, no, I don't. Yes, you do, Trover. You, just the other day, you called him a lazy lap llama with limp dick little llama legs. I heard you say it. Uh, are you gonna fucking deny it to me right now in my face when I fucking heard you say it? And I fucking saw your lips move when you said it? You little fucking twerp. Now let's save the goddamn universe, Trover. Jesus Christ, look, I, I may have said those things, but it's different now. We're, 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 we're bonded. We're partners. I mean, you know what? We're gonna change the subject. We're gonna change the subject. Uh, we, 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 we got the crystal babies. Let's go. Uh, let's let's go. Fuck it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Yeah, Trover. Let's go do it. Whatever you say. I, what? I, I I don't even care. We're gonna save the cosmos. Take the crystal babies to the abstainers. Plug them into their eyes and reconnect them, and then we'll reconvene and discuss the next steps. So listen. You. I, I'm a different person now than I was, you know? I did used to be cherished. And yeah, I used to pee in the sink. And yes, I, I fucked a shrinkle and a dinkle. But I'm changed. I feel changed since I've been with you and kind of we've been going on doing all this stuff together. I feel different towards Cherorpians, you know? I, you're just like me. We're on another level of friendship now. I drink a beer with you at my favorite drinking hole, the Empty Peepers. That's the place in my home world that I love to go to. They know how to deliver a drink right into your eye holes, but I'm sure we'd figure out a way for you to enjoy a drink there too. I'd tell them you're my pal, my Cherorpian pal, and I'd defend your back, because I know they'd all be really cherished towards you, because most of my planet is cherished. But anyways, you're my best friend now. Let's go finish up this shit. We're gonna be done with this, and then you and me are gonna be in Empty Peepers. Jeez, he seems wasted. Oh man, you know, I've been dying to tell you guys. You know, you know why Glorcon's doing all this, right? It's because of his true love. He's been trying to create the perfect recipe of planet combinations to bring about the existence of his dream girl. You know, his hello, and hello, Trover. Please hurry, install the crystal creatures into the drunk abstainer's eyes. I'm... Uh, 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 uh. Alright, so, so, what, what do you want us to do to, you know, to help you get to be four? What do you think, Dum Dum? You, you have, have to find two more of the crystal creatures, creatures and then somehow get them plugged into Glorcon's eye holes. 
that will unite the four of us and we will once again be back in normal and the, the whole thing, the reunited thing that we talked about earlier in the game. Alright, okay, we're gonna head out. Good, head out. And as you walk back to the telepod, we'll just go ahead and let you know that, you know, we don't know what's going on. You know, our brains are all amok. You know, it's all muddied. We can't really predict the future of anything right now because Glorcon's out there changing the present. You know, he's doing things and we don't know what the hell those the rippling effects are. We don't even know what he's up to. We have no idea what he's doing, but all we know is it's, it, we know for sure he's, he's just trying to bring a, bring about the, the true love of his life. And, and you gotta just get those special creatures. Uh, anyways, what do, you, what, do you, what do you guys wanna talk about? We're all talking in one unified voice. We're gonna put a special effect on all this so it sounds like three voices, like a flange or a chorus effect or something. So it actually sounds like three characters talking despite the fact that it's just me, one, just me, the voice actor, talking. It's just one voice, but we put a special effect to make it sound like three characters talking at once. You know what, I'm done, I'm, I'm done. I said enough. Who gives a shit about any of this? Hopefully you're already at the telepod and you've already closed the doors and you've left and we're just talking to ourselves. Trover, good work. I see you've uh, got the abstainers all linked up. That's good to hear. Now, you're gonna have to get those last two crystals and you're gonna wanna go meet my buddy, one of my pals, a fella named George. He's got the next pair of special creatures stored in a secret place, secret planet. He'll probably hand them over to you with little effort on your part. He's a good dude, one of my best pals. And I uh, hope you guys, uh, Chair Orpian, you doing, you feeling pretty good? You doing okay? All right, good, that's good. That's good to hear. I'm happy to hear that you're feeling good. All right, get out there and we're getting close. We're getting close to the final part of this whole thing. Boss, I'm feeling a little weird right now because we just found out Glorcon's motivation is just true love. Oh, oh that makes you feel weird, does it? Does that make you feel weird, Chair Orpian? It does? Huh, well that's strange. I, I guess it is a noble and sort of relatable uh, motivation. He's just trying to find his true love. I mean, if anyone's ever been in love, they can certainly understand that, but but it doesn't matter. He's trying to destroy the cosmos, and we need to get out there. So, so hurry up and get on to George. He's my pal. He's gonna hook you up. George, go talk to him. Take the telepod there. Hurry up. Get a hustle on. I'm bathtub guy. Oh shit! Oh, I I'm so sorry, hey, partner. I, I don't think this is George. Uh, the telepod might have misfired. Oh yes, I'm George. But when I'm in the bathroom, people call me bathtub guy. You guys here to play a little midnight shuffle? I mean, listen, we do have big stuff to do, but uh, I, well, I, maybe what's midnight shuffle? You know, midnight shuffle is when two. Don't disrespect me by touching my duck. What the hell is wrong with you? Shit! Look, I'm sorry, man. Okay, okay. okay. Hey, what the hell are you doing? Stop messing with my goddamn duck. Partner, would you just listen to him? Okay, like I was saying, look, I gotta be at a birthday party in about a... 
What the fuck are you doing? That's my duck. Put my goddamn duck down. Now you better not. Thank you. You must be ignorant. I already... Thank you. Finally. Okay, cool. So, look. I gotta be at a birthday party in about an hour. But if we hurry, I'm sure we can get it done. All right, look, hey, listen. We're not here for some midnight shuffle, okay? Our boss sent us here to pick up some crystal babies. Oh, shit. But well, why did you say so? I know, boss. That SOB owes me 13 space dollars and 15 space hairs. <laughs> he came over one time for a little cream dream action. That's when two dudes turn up the AC really high, then sit in the bathtub full of cream corn and scream that ever-loving ass off. Ooh-wee, it's fun. <laughs> anyway, 12 days go by, and we finally get out of the tub, right? I mean, look at our bodies were all pruny. My fingers were so tiny I wanted to touch them. And just as he's about to leave, I go, Hey, man, that'll be 13 space dinero. And he's like, 13 what? Then, all of a sudden, Boss takes off running. Now, I don't know if you know this or not, but Boss is as agile as a greased baby going down a water slide. So, the only way I'm going to catch him is if I pull out my hookah kooky and give him a whirl and pearly. So, that's what I do. I mean, that in real estate, of course. I've been selling a lot of real estate. Come on, you stupid. <laughs> Holy shit! Partner, you just killed this guy! George, or whatever, bathtub guy, whatever his name is! Not that, it, not that any of that matters, because without the crystal babies, we can't continue! This is crumbelievable! You broke the progress of the game! It's over! You can't progress anymore! You're gonna have to restart the whole game, and start all the way over from the very beginning, and when you get to this part, don't kill this bathtub character! I wish you could jump me in that bathtub and kill me too, but there's some invisible wall collision thing there. This is bullshit. You broke the game. You ruined the game. I think I might be related to that guy, and also, I know exactly where Tech World is. I know how to get there, too. It's already programmed. The, the coordinates are programmed in the telepod already. We're, the game isn't stuck. We can keep going. We can keep progressing. Let's get a move on to Tech World. This is... Wow, partner, would you take a look at this cool tech world, this gear world? Man, this is gonna be a fun one to explore. I can't wait to dive into every nook and cranny of this cool tech world. Looks like they're trapped in some force fields inside of a weird mech machine. Let's go get them. Oh, look 
fuck who it is, it's fuck face and shit ass. You're both fucked this time, we're not fucking around. Yeah, that's right, we're gonna fucking murder you. Yeah, you tell him. I am telling him. What the fuck are you doing? I'm gonna fight. I'm gonna prepare myself to fight. Why are you being so quiet? Fuck you, I'm not being quiet. Suck my dick. Hey, what the fuck? That's it, I'm fucking murdering you. I'm in murder mode. Glorcon commanded us to murder you. We are loyal to our DNA father. Everyone shut the fuck up. Oh. Man, those Glorcon clones, bunch of idiots. Uh, no idea how they keep popping up wherever we are. No time to soak in the landscape. We gotta get these, these crystal creatures and then figure out a way how to get them into Glorcon's eyes. Whoa, whoa, these gears. Whoa, we're on the gears. Creatures and get back to the telepod and find out what the hell boss wants us to do. How, how he expects us to plug him into Glorcon's face. I mean, how the hell are we gonna pull that off, you know? What are we gonna go back to his home world and, and do it there? Alright, anyways, uh, let's get the things. I don't know. Is this too. Am I talking too long? Get him and let's get the hell out of here. Ha ha ha! Surprised? It's me. That's right. I, you played right into my hands. You're a couple of fucking idiots. The bomb I planted in your telepod was never intended to kill you or the abstainers. I wanted you to merge the abstainers. You wanna know why? Because of this. With this device, I'm going to be able to merge a bunch of worlds using, that's right, the power of the abstainers. Now with the crystal babies plugged into my device, they're connected to the other three abstainers. Here we go. Oh, <laughs> it worked. This is just the start. 
small machine and just a handful of worlds. My next machine is going to include the power of your dogs, and it's going to merge 87 worlds down to five massive ones all in one fell swoop. Unfortunately, it's going to kill the other three abstainers as well as your dogs in the process. What a shame. Oh, what a shame. Too bad you're trapped here with no way out, no food, no water, no telepod. All according to plan. Now that everything's all jumbled up, no one's going to be able to help find you. Good luck, you shit fucks. Suck my little balls. Oh, God! Oh, jeez, partner! Now we're trapped with no place to go. We're basically like Tom Hanks and Castaway. You know, we're gonna have to live the rest of our lives here. I mean, this is it. Glorcon won. This is horrible. I mean, you know, we gotta focus on survival now. We got we we gotta just let everything. Forget about the dogs. Forget about, you know, trying to stop Lorcan. It's Tom Hanks style now, from Castaway. Ever see that movie? I mean, you should check it out real quick, and then come back, so we, we're gonna have to deal with this. I mean, this, we're, we gotta start figuring out where we're gonna get food. We, we should start trying to build shelter. Hello, excuse me, we need some help here. Hey, hey, uh, what's, what's going on? Boss sent me out here to say there was some commotion going on, so I came in my Z telepod. Have you heard of one of those? Of course you haven't. It's my fucking telepod. It's the newest telepod. I just cleaned it outside, inside. I fucking love that telepod. Uh, it's just over there. The commotion you're talking about is just right around the corner. All right, cool. I'm going to solve this mystery. I'm going to get to the bottom of this. I'm Pink Trover. There's going to be a whole spinoff of me on this game. I got a story, too. I'm Pink. I'm awesome. And I'm going to figure this shit out. Nobody's going to fuck with me. That pink fucking version of me, there's a lot of us, has a fucking telepod. You heard him? It's right around the corner. Let's go! Hurry! It's our only way out of here. I don't want to be fucking trapped here for the rest of my life. That poor pink trover. What an idiot. What a dummy. Holy shit. But also, wow, this is a really nice fancy telepod. I mean, it's better than that garbage we've been using this whole time. I mean, it's got different, it's different colors. I think this is a T8000 model. Wow. It's got all kinds of doodads in here. I mean, it looks pretty much the same, but I mean, there's all kinds of doodads in it. Pink Trover, what, what did you find out? Oh, it's you two. I must have misdialed. Trover, Cherorpion, things are looking very grim. Several wor worlds have been merged. Your dogs and the abstainers are going to be killed. I can't get a hold of the abstainers. Glorcon's blocked access to their inner sanctum. Telepod is blocked from going there too. Come to my office. Hurry. I I'll brief you there on what the next steps are, but this shit is all totally changed. Shit's all fucked up. It's unpredictable. Everything just took a giant left turn. I'll see you at my office. We fucking played right into Glorcon's hands. We're, 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 we're fucking idiots. He's a, he, we thought he was so stupid. He's a fucking genius. He played us like a fiddle. And now he's got control of the abstainers. And, and he's, and he's, um... And he's got the crystal babies. We need those fucking crystal babies, you know? And, and he's got your dog still. We haven't really done anything. We haven't done much of anything. I mean, this might as well be the beginning of the video game. I mean, we might as well have started the video game, like, right here, narratively. Because that's basically where we're at. We're basically at the fucking be beginning, aside from all the fucking, you know, narrative story arc with, between you and me and, like, you know, our friendship and all that stuff. I mean, we may as well, this may as well be the boot up screen for the game right now. Because we're fucking back to square zero. This is fucked. Jesus Christ, what the fuck are we gonna do? Shit, I didn't see this coming. D did you see this coming? Yes or no? Come on. Nod your little fucking peanut head. Did you see this shit coming or not? Oh, really? You, you, you saw this coming? Yeah, I, I, I find that very highly unlikely. You fucking lying little peanut head. Now let's get the fuck out of here and figure this shit out.
Trover, Chair Orpion, what took you so long to get back here? What were you, playing with your ding-dong? Yes or no? You weren't playing with your little ding-dong. All right, well, that's good. Let's jump into this. A bunch of worlds are all destroyed. You know, th th this device is being powered by the abstainers through the crystal babies. All right, y boss, w w what do the abstainers say? I mean, w what do the abstainers want us to do? We've lost all contact with the abstainers, Trover. The last thing they said to me was... The Glorcon was planning to blow up a bunch of planets in the Tarvo galaxy, which is admittedly very, very far away and fairly inconsequential to us, but still, it's it's just a bunch of crazy bullshit. Wait a minute, so all, all he was gonna do was just merge a handful of worlds together? That's a big deal, Trover. This motherfucker merged a bunch of worlds together, and uh, uh, quite frankly, we don't know if he's gonna do it again. I think he probably will. Well, Jesus Christ, what the fuck are we gonna do? This guy's... This guy played us! That's right, Trover, he played you. I, I've been busy playing cards. Now shut the fuck up. L listen to me, I have a plan. We still have the coordinates to Glorcon's home planet. That's where he's keeping his world merging device. That's where his secret base is. And that's where the crystal babies are. The only problem is the planet is being shielded by a giant impenetrable force field. All we have to do is shut down the force field. It's easy. Well, how do we do that? What, what the fuck? What, what are we supposed to do? Trover, we gotta blow up Mixed World. Mixed World is powering... Gorkon's force field around his secret base planet. You, wanna, you want us to blow up a planet? A bunch of planets that are merged together? Are you fucking serious? You, you hear Trover, yourself? I don't want to hear any more of this out of you. Cherorpian, do you think you're up for this? Oh, yeah, confident, huh? Real confident. You better be. Anyway, Glorcon just destroyed a handful of worlds, merging them together, and he created one giant mixed world. That's a problem. He's also gonna kill your dogs, Cherorpian. And the abstainers are gonna die too. I mean, is that enough stakes for us? I mean, you got all that, Trover? You following along here? Yeah, yes, yes, okay, we got it. Okay, on this mixed world, there's a bomb planting site. You're gonna need to plant a bomb in that receptacle. Where the fuck are we? Where's this bomb you're talking about? Where, where, where? I'm getting to that, Trover, goddammit, if you let me fucking finish my conversation. In order to get the bomb, you're gonna need to go talk to my good friend, one of the funniest guys I know comedy guy. He's my best friend, one of my best friends, and he also happens to be a bomb expert. And and he'll tell some hilarious jokes, he'll lift your spirits, his name is comedy guy, he has the bomb. So just, whenever you're ready, go ahead and press the button on the telepod and it'll take you to comedy guy. And then from there, you'll go to Mixed World. Jesus Christ, what a hot mess. Partner, come on, hit the button. Let's go to comedy guy and get this bomb. M maybe we'll hear some jokes, I, I don't know. Ugh. <sighs> Man, you know, you know, whenever the chips are down, comedy guy's there to get, to give you a little laugh and a chuckle. You know, he he always brings a smile to the table. Uh huh. He's, you know, and he's got a good, lovable, you know, rated G type sense of humor. Uh, e for everyone tone with his comedy. He's very, but it'll still make the edgiest person laugh because his comedy is so sharp and honed. And he's just, he's such a light, delightful, lovable, happy-go-lucky character. He's always funny and laughing and just having uh -huh. a great time. And, and it's so, it's, and he also happens to know a lot about bombs and, you know, like how to make really ex horrible explosive bombs that could devastate uh -huh. and destroy. He, it's a weird coincidence, but it's great. Thank God it's him and not someone else because you need a laugh. Yeah. Things are dark. Things are, we're in our darkest days right now. Uh -huh. This is the darkest part. And we need a good chuckle and a smile. So Comedy Guy's my good friend, and he's good and he's great. It's going to make you chuckle, and you're going to get a good laugh out of it. Uh-huh. And boy, oh boy, I wish I could be there. I wish I could go with you. I, I need a laugh too, but i got to stay back here and man the station. Man, this is a bunch of bullshit. I can't believe Glorcon played us like he did. And, and all this shit would have happened whether I had been with you or not. I, I, I could have been doing my own thing this whole time, you know? I, mean, I stuck around with you for what? And, and now we gotta blow up a planet? I mean, Jesus Christ. That sounds like what bad guys do, blowing up planets. Uh, all right, look, let's just check out Comedy Guy's routine, get the bomb, and then go blow up this entire planet. You've seen his light-hearted comedy on Flea Shack. No, you know him from his silly, family-friendly prop comedy masterpiece, Floppy Props. And he's been a regular on David Letterman for years. Let's give a warm round of applause to Comedy Guy! Oh my!
my God, he hung himself. You know, he, he always joked about it, but I just thought he was doing a bit. Jeez, do you know how fucking hard this has been for me and, and now I have to deal with this? What, what, what am I, the, the guy from 127 Hours? Did you see that movie? The guy got the shaft, big rock fell on his arm. This is 127 hours, plus an extra hour. 128 hours of me getting screwed. We were supposed to get a bomb. We were supposed to pick up a bomb from this guy. Where is the bomb? Oh my God, you know, th this isn't my fight. I, di I didn't start this shit. I, I, I feel like Elian Gonzalez right now, remember him? He wrote on dolphins and he was involved in a huge international... Holy shit, it's the bomb, there it is. There's the freaking bomb. L let's get it and get the hell out of here. Partner, please, just let's go. Just get me in the telepod, please. I want to get the fuck out of here. This isn't my war. Fuck this. I just wanted to get high off of some power babies. And, and, and now this? I'm like Swandy over here. The, you know, the, the, the guy that was arrested for a little too much pep in his step? The guy did jack shit. He just skipped across the street. This is bullshit. His name was Swansy. Look, partner, I, I don't know how to say this, but I can't do this anymore, okay? W w once we blow up this planet, I'm, 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 I'm striking out. I'm getting the fuck out. I I'm not going to Glorkon Super Base. I, 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 lo I care about you, and, 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 and I really, I want you to succeed, and I think you will, but, but you're doing it without me, because he probably just ripped my fucking head off. Are you kidding? He, he you saw what he did. He played us. And I'll help you, and we're gonna do this last thing together, and then it's bon voyage for me, you know? We'll, we'll, we'll watch this place blow up from space, and I'm gonna go to Empty Peepers, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna hire a couple of hookers. Listen, I'm sorry, partner. Uh, are, are, are you cool with this? Is this okay with you? You understand, right? Yeah, I mean, uh, I figured you'd say that, partner. So that's why I've really grown to care about you, you know? And, uh, and I'm sorry. I'm sorry, but I, I, I got to. I just got to. I mean, I got to get the fuck out of here, you know? But we'll do your thing. We'll, we'll blow this place up, and then you'll, you'll probably get reassigned a new partner. All right, partner. W one last level, you and me, for, for old time's sake, huh? important to this whole thing anyways.
are you thinking about right now? I don't know, I'm just thinking about uh, how much I like this world. It's all mixed up. That's not what you were really thinking about. I could tell. You're lying to me. No, I'm not. I'm telling the truth. I was thinking about how I like this mixed up, crazy, topsy turvy world right now. No, you're not. You were thinking about how you want to stuff your leg up my ass. How did you know that's what I was thinking about? I caught you in a lie. You want to stuff your leg all the way up my ass. Yeah, I do. I do, actually. I was too shy to tell you. Hey, you don't have to be shy about that. We're buddies. We're, we're, we're clones. You know, we're, we're the same thing, basically. So go ahead. You can stick your entire foot up, your whole leg up my ass. Go ahead. Well, hold on. If I stick my leg up your ass, does that mean you're going to want to stick your leg up my ass? You know it. If you stick your leg up my ass, I'm only letting you do it so I can stick my leg up your ass. Ugh. Well, then now I need to think about it, because I, I wasn't thinking about I'd want a leg up my ass. Come on, we're clones. We're supposed to be the same kind of... same thing. I thought you would be the same thing as me. Man, I just wanted to see what it would feel like to have my leg up some up someone's ass. You know, all the way all the way to the, the upper thigh. That's all I wanted. Sounds like this whole leg up the ass thing isn't going to happen, because you won't agree to let me do it to you, so why don't we just, just do our jobs, which is supposed to be looking for a chair or and trover in case they show up, you know? Which is probably not going to happen. <laughs> Said you two might show up. Said we could kill you. Okay, we're done with that. Let's move. Without me, you know, I know Boss will partner you up with the new eye hole monster. You know, there's Schlover, the trans uh, uh, eye hole monster, voiced by an actual trans person. No, no, uh, no, no, no messing around there. There's other eye hole monsters. Remember the pink eye hole monster we saw when Gorkon merged all the worlds together? You know, there, there, there's Dover. He, he's uh, he's green colored. He's an eyehole monster. The guy, the guy's great. He's amazing. He's a karate expert. But guess what? Big twist. He's Irish. Also voiced by an actual, authentic Irish person. We're very proud of that. Um, Boss could also potentially partner you up with Lover, who's uh, a lot like me, but African American and funny and witty and has all these great commentaries and a whole different perspective on, you know everything really good character voiced by a white person though just want to give you a heads up there that one was whitewashed i do apologize for that but anyways the point is you're gonna get partnered with a whole new eye hole monster and you're the real important thing not not me uh, you know i'm not important <laughs> Wonderful. Here we go. Here we oh, go. Look at, look at who it is here. We're gonna take. We're gonna make sure that the whole shit don't get any further in this. Whatever the fuck you're trying to do. Oh, 
Okay, let's go. That's, that's gotta be it. I gotta tell you, man, I feel horrible. You know, I feel horrible about, about not coming through for you on this, but you know I'm gonna walk into that Glorcon base, and the guy's probably just gonna pick me up and rip my head off, throw it across the room. He'd probably kill you too, you know? I'm telling you, man, we gotta just stick together, and let's just call this whole thing off. Here's what we should do. After we're done blowing this place up, because fuck that guy, we might as well do that. We, we, we should use the telepod to go to my home world. Come with me. Come to my home world. Empty peepers. We'll go to empty peepers. We'll get some drinks. You know, I, I'll convince all of the other eye hole monsters there that you're not, you know, that you're one of the good ones. And that's why I don't want you to go to this through, through with this. I mean, for what? To save your dogs? How old were your dogs? I mean, how... How long do dogs live for, anyways? I mean, what, what do they? What do they have? A couple more years on them? Like five years left or something? I mean, come on! Is it, is it really worth it? Second. All right, partner, you got this. You can figure this out. I, I, I'm not. I'm not too good for this stuff. This is on you. Pictures is a story about a smoking hot blind mom who's helping this monster see that the only thing scarier than himself is not being in love. I love you, Martha. I love you too, Gary. Coming this summer from Proppy Pictures. Blind monster, blonde mom. 
Fuck, I wish that was a real movie. When I was trapped in the cave, I created up that whole movie trailer idea. That's my original idea. And don't you try to steal it. I copyrighted it. I already wrote the letter that I self-addressed stamped to myself with my idea sealed inside. It's dated. You'll never steal my idea. Copyright people, I I'm gonna keep that letter in my drawer. It's guaranteed to tug on your heartstrings, that movie. It's a real emotional love story. It's about a blind mom, and she's really attractive. But And then there's, and then there's a monster character who gets her to fall in love. It's a lot like that movie, uh, you know, Toxic Adventure. Uh, except for she's a mom, and uh, and the monster is cool. The monster is, he's like me. I'm the mom. It's a lot like me. I would obviously cast my. Whoa! What the hell? Partner, we're having some fun together on this last level that we're gonna be together on. Cause I'm I'm, I'm out of here after this. Can't make it clear enough. Into. It's across the lake. Fuck. There, there's got to be some way over there. What in the goddamn hell? How did those two get over here? We got a murderer on the kind of way to bury a shaman. If they find something. I'm sure of it. Uh, maybe not. Maybe there's some other way we can get across the lake. I, I just don't want to go inside a butthole. To this we're gonna have fun we're gonna have a good time down here as we make our way
forward. One. Hey, can, can you see me? I, I, I can't see you. It's dark in here. Where are you? Hello? Hello? I can't see you. It's really dark. Or, 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 or I'm blind. I think I'm blind. I, I, I think I went blind. Or it's dark in here. Could be just dark in here. Relax. Marco. Marco. No, I say, uh, you say Polo. I'm gonna say Marco. No, I wanna say Marco, and you say Polo. All right, fine, go ahead. Polo. No, you're supposed to say, you wanted to say Marco. All right, Marco. Okay, Polo. Marco. Polo. Marco. Polo. Marco. Polo. 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 Marco. Oh, look who it is. It's Dummy and Dummy. We're gonna kill the both of you. You're dead. Fucking guys! Oh. What the fuck is wrong with those guys? Let's lighten, let's lighten the mood. We're gonna be splitting ways after this, so let's have a good time here for, for this last level that we're gonna be together. Let's get some funny jokes in. What did the wrinkly old dick say to the massive plump butt cheeks? Spread them, spread out. That's a good one, huh? It makes me laugh every time I hear it. What do you get when you mix a chairorpian and a glass blower? A stupid, ugly, dumb fuck who knows how to blow glass. Hey, hey, hey I'm just kidding. We're having fun here. Ah, huh, this is fun. My mom told me I could be anything, so I put her heels on and told her to go clean her room. She crowned me. You think blind people know it's pink lemonade? Murder is a lot like clipping your toenails. Nobody wants you to... Jesus Christ! What garbage joke book did we get these from? This isn't even fun anymore! I mean, I'm sorry your entire world got destroyed, but, but, what, but why do we have to suffer? What did the baby say to the eye roll? Spread them! I'm just rewording old jokes at this point. If you want to hear comedy routine, go to a Netflix special or something. I'm not just some monkey that's here to entertain you the whole time. The fuck? No, this is empty peepers. No, no, this can't be. No, empty peepers is on my home world. This means my world got mixed up too. What the fuck? No, it's not supposed to be here. Oh my god, empty peepers. My home world is gone. Oh my god, Angela, the waitress is dead. She was such a good waitress. She didn't even care if we didn't tip her. This is all Glorcon's fault. This is empty peepers. This is the fucking place. This is where I go. Everyone's dead. It's a, a massacre. Oh my god, it's, it's Ralph. We used to make plastic explosives together. We, we, we didn't even know what we were doing. We would just get a bucket of gasoline and dump styrofoam into it and, and, and we'd play with it. He's dead. Oh my god. Ay -ay 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 -ay! Oh my god. Empty peepers. Tobias, my mute hairstylist. He's dead. Ah! He's dead. That guy was the best. He, he cut my hair just the way I wanted. He charged me 25 bucks and that included the tip. And he never tried to start small talk because he saw dead bodies when he was a kid. And he hasn't been able to speak since. Now, now where the hell am I going to find another barber like that? He did a perfect cut every time. She had to tilt her head and to the side and just a little bit to get the dick out of her way. She was a good-looking girl too, but it was like, man, why don't why don't you just get that thing removed? You know, nose jobs aren't that uncommon. Not that it matters anymore because she's dead now, along with everybody from my home planet. <laughs> Ginger! 
She cleaned out my eye holes after they got infected from using dirty green power babies. Now what am I supposed to do? Get high off of old sterile power babies like some fucking loser? Murphy's Bakery is gone. I love that place. It was naughty. It was a naughty little donut shop that made the most delectable danishes. It also doubled as an elderly trafficking ring. They'd snatch up your shriveled, schnurled Nana and put her to work. Was it ethical? No. Did it make their basement smell like a used urinal cake? Yes. Was it all worth it for the danishes? Yes, it was. But it's gone now. It's all gone. Everyone's dead. Rabbi Brodick, he's dead now too. We, we, we peed in the water balloons and chucked him at old zoo animals. He said it felt good. I don't know if he meant sexually or what, but he sure enjoyed doing it. He's dead now too. Oh my God. Oh, I'm reeling. I'm reeling. Oh, oh my God. I can't even wrap my head around this. The guy that bagged my groceries, the one with the sideburns, what, what was his name? Patrice? He had the best sideburns, and he's dead now. It was like he ripped off Wilford Brimley's mustache and attached him to the side of it, the sides of his head. Everyone's gone. I can't even handle this. Phil Faskin. I don't know why that guy just popped into my head. I, I, I never really was that close to him, but he's dead now. Phil. Gladys is dead now, too. I mean, she was bound to die any minute, but still, she didn't deserve to be wiped off the planet like that. She deserved to die alone in her car, like she was supposed to. We locked her in there. No air, no food, no water. Jesus Christ. Fuck. Oh my god, Doug! Doug, my sworn enemy! The scum of the earth! He unscrewed the Parmesan shaker so that when I used it, it went everywhere! Son of a bitch ruined my ravioli! My lobster ravioli! It was the special of that night, too! It was $25.99 and he ruined it! After that day, I swore in a stack of nudie mags that I'd get my revenge on Doug, and Glorcon took that away from me! Also, I can't prove this, but I think Doug was telling people that I've been soliciting oral sex to na naive tourists! Have you heard about that? It's total bullshit, just so you know. Now all those tourists are dead. Everyone's dead, even Doug is dead. Oh my god, I, I, I'm, I'm upset. This is hurts. It hurts. Aaron, the busboy at Empty Peepers. Or would she be the bus girl? Whatever, she bust tables and I loved her. We were gonna move to the country together. I'd work the land and she'd tend to the house. We'd grow old together. Until late one evening, I'd return home to find her in bed with Dennis. And I'm into it. I mean, really. I mean, really into it. Maybe too into it. I'm doing her this way, Dennis is doing me that way, and we're all covered in cock snot. But none of that matters now because she's dead. Dennis is dead too. It's all because of Glorcon. Oh my god, I can't even, I can't even, I'm, I'm, I can't calm down. I just realized that everyone that's closest to me is dead, then who could I be openly spacist around? I'm not saying that I am, because I'm not, but you know, being ironically spacist, a good kinkle joke every now and again doesn't hurt anybody. Like, what did one kinkle say to the other kinkle during sex? I like cottage cheese and I deserve to die, get it? Because they're kinkles. God, see, this is what I'm talking about. I can't even say this stuff around other people. Frumpies now, you ever been there? You shop there much? It's a clothing- What the hell? What, what are you doing here? How the hell are you guys still around? Hit em. We gotta kill them. killing Hit all em. these guys! Fire, fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! Murdering all these motherfuckers! This is for Patrice! Don't let me die here! It'll be really embarrassing! Oh, I want you all down, you 
about the same amount of health points, and there's no special super abilities or anything, but I am really mad, and, I'm, and we're gonna fucking, we're gonna take care of business. Okay, that, I think that's it, let's go. How many of these Glorcon clones do you think we've killed? Location. Just place the bomb in the receptacle. Oh my god, I feel lightheaded right now. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay, good, you got the bomb in there. All right, L -l let's keep moving. Let's get the fuck out of here. It's gonna blow up at some point. I I it's on some kind of self timer thing. I don't know. Oh my god. Oh, Jesus Christ. I feel sick. I don't feel good right now. You don't understand what I'm going through. Oh my god, I also never got to use that punch card for one of the free meals at Tony's Tantas! You know what I'm talking- Are you kidding me? You know what I'm talking about? The chain restaurant where, where men with I, the ideal bodies and low-cut khakis serve you food and say things like, hot enough for you? Do you know how many hot men, ham hoagies, I had to eat in order to get that free meal? Now it's worthless! Oh my god, I'm spinning! My head's spinning right now! I just realized I'm not going to be able to catch the last season of Naked and Hard. Have you seen it? It's a reality show where they strip down two dudes and stiffen up their dinky dinkles. Then drop them off on a deserted island. First dinkle to shrinkle loses. Can you imagine that? Trying to survive all the natural elements while maintaining a daddy dinkle? And now I won't even be able to see who wins a million bucks thanks to that fucking son of a bitch Glorcon. I had space money on that. Oh my god! I'll also never get the chance to meet my biological oh, parents! Oh man, you really think that, uh, the Chorpion and the, uh, little purple eyehole monster are gonna make it way the fuck over here on the other side of this mixed world that Glorcon created? Man, I don't know. What do I look like? Uh, Houdini? Mr. Uh, knower of all stuff? Yeah, you're right, I'm sorry. You should be sorry. Fucking bullshit. You piss me off when you fucking put me on the on the block like that. Hey man, don't talk about blocks. What do you mean, don't talk about blocks? I mean, that's disrespectful to all my friends. I had a lot of friends that are blocks. Are you talking about your fucking toy blocks? Yeah, I am. Well, listen, you shouldn't talk about it. Get over here, son of a bitch. Shit. Fucking fuck in their face. Oh, shit. Fuck you. Fucking sons of bitches. You know what? what? Fuck it! Forget it! I'm sick of remembering all this! What the fuck? You guys are fucking dead! Fuck! This! Bull! Shit! Fuck it! I'm coming out of your fucking ass! Oh, you fucking jerk! Nipples are still not pierced. Oh, fuck you, oh, punk. Oh. Fucking god, god damn it! Oh. Fucking son of a bitch! Oh. Fucking kill him! Oh, son shit. of a fucking oh. bitch! Lord god, piece of shit! Oh, oh, fuck oh. this! Bullshit! I'm pissed now! I'm fucking invested in this shit! I'm invested in this bullshit now! My fucking people are dead! Fucking pissed! Lord god, son of a fuck! Fuck this shit! I'm gonna fuck you up, huh? Fuck Glorcon! I'm going with you, partner! We're gonna blow this fucking planet up, and we're going to Glorcon's home base! And we're gonna fucking kill him. Now I just need to calm down. Just, I just, I just kind of processed a lot of stuff. Kind of just, I just need a moment, just to be quiet. Mourn the loss of my planet and all my, all the, all the eye hole monsters on it. You know, partner. 
sort of fill you in on what I was thinking back there. When I found out that Glorcon wasn't going to destroy the whole cosmos, I, I, I was sort of thinking, you know, shit, this is, this is my ticket out of here, you know? I, I don't need to worry about this. And when I saw that my whole planet was also clumped up with this other world and destroyed and everyone I know and love is dead, I mean, that kind of really sort of turned the key for me. So, not to state the obvious, I mean, we, 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 we both just did all this together. I mean, you already know this. So you and me, partner, we're gonna fucking save your dogs. We're gonna avenge the death of my planet and all the people I knew. And I'm gonna fucking murder this Glorcon guy. You're gonna help me do it, partner. Let's have a moment of quiet, cause we're almost there. And I'm fucking pumped. Any second now, this place is gonna blow. You ever play Tonky? That's where you rip someone's head off and you just kick it around. Just kick it around like some- Oh shit! Oh my god! Oh fuck! Oh Jesus Christ! There it goes! Wow, that- that gave me a startle. This must have taken a long time to animate all this. Hey you guys, good work. You blew up Mixed World, took care of that business. Guarantee you, uh, Glorcon didn't see that coming. Anyways, how was Comedy Guy? Didn't get to ask you about that. How great was he, right? Comedy Guy's the best. I can't tell you how much I cherish that man. He is a gift. He really is. He's a gift to all people. Wait, 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 what? You, you guys are acting weird when I talk about Comedy Guy. What's, what's going on? Uh, nothing. He's, he's great. He's, Comedy Guy really was the best. Is that so? Uh, Chair Orpian, what, what, what did you think of Comedy Guys? Trover, telling the truth, was he pretty great? What do you mean he wasn't great? What, 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 not, not your cup of tea? Not your sensibility? Not, not, uh, not the kind of comedy you prefer? Jeez, you Chair Orpians and your culture of outrage. Why don't you go outside and find a laugh? Get, fall off a tree and live a little? Uh, what does it take to please you? It's a joke, capiche? You are a real weirdo, that's all I gotta say. You you and I are not the same kind of people, apparently. Anyways, I was able to triangulate the coordinates to, uh, it'll take you right to the inside of Glorcon's base. You guys have done good. You really worked hard. Chorpion, you impressed me. Wasn't quite sure what to make of you at the beginning, but you really, you got a bunch of upgrades and I'm really impressed and proud of you. And Trover, what, what do I say? You know, you, you're a good employee. You're a work for hire, but you really put 110% into the job. Uh, you got upgrades yourself. I'm proud of you. Good work. Uh, you know, on your guys' funerals or gravestones, I'm going to put some real encouraging words if you die, if you don't make it. So don't let's worry about that. I'll take care of that. I'll wrap up some nice obituaries. You guys are great. You did good work. You're good people. Um, you know, you're wonderful. All right, you ready for this? We're gonna go in there and we're gonna do it together, partner. It's all locked up. Of course we weren't gonna be able to just walk in here and... Wait, 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 hold on, hold on. Hold on, shh. I hear something. These images of Lorcan's true love and analyzing the eight buttholes, the seven vaginas, and the 17 rock hard penises. Uh, it's enough already. Yeah, yeah, maybe you're right. Maybe, maybe we should, you know, keep patrolling us. I don't know, I don't know. I don't know. I'm not looking at it. I'm not looking at it. I'm not looking at it. I'm not
way here. I don't care what Gorkon said. Look, call me. Shit, there they are. They're here. Hey, what the fuck? Oh, 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 oh. I'm gonna get the certificate. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna get the certificate of achievement if I stop them. Man, would you take a look at that? Glorcon's true love. Huh, can't really see all the dicks or any of the boobies or, you know, the buttholes from this angle of the artistic rendering, but I can see enough to make a judgment call. What do you think, partner? You, you, uh, you attracted to that? Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. No, me, me, me too, me too. I, I, yeah, that, I, it's super gross. 100%. Totally on the same page. Super not cool at all. Like, I wouldn't, I, 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 would, I, I agree 100% with you. Let's keep a move on. Find this Glorcon guy and kill him. Hey, what the hell? I was listening to my music. Get out of my room. You guys shouldn't be in my room. This is my room. What? What are you talking about? Where the fuck is Glorcon? Are we on the right path? Are we heading towards Glorcon? Get the fuck out of my room. You don't know what it's like to be a Glorcon clone. You don't know how hard it is out there. You don't know why all the Glorcon clones make fun of me and there's lots of bully Glorcon clones. This isn't how I want to be treated and be disrespected like this in my room. You're oppressing me. You're oppressing me by coming in my room. This is a you're, you're an oppressive force. Now, hey, don't throw Whoa! Oh, All right. Oh. The electricity sparks are uh, lethal. That's good for us. That's one step closer to Glorcon and this and Meek slitting his fucking throat open. Shit, partner. I think this might be it. And we're gonna get your dogs back, and everything's gonna be saved, and we're gonna save the whole universe. And 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 I love you, partner. I didn't want to say that before, you know. I know that's a lot to say. I love you. It's a it's a big thing to drop on a partner. I love you, partner. Anyways, whoo boy. It's a long hallway here. This is a long fucking hallway. God damn. It's awkward, you know. It's awkward when you tell somebody you love them, you know. It's it's an awkward situation we're in right now. Oh, there's the exit. Okay, we're here. Well, well, well. It's Trover and the Cherorpion. You dare fucking what? enter what? my chamber? My special chamber? That's right, you piece of shit. You fucking murdered everybody. You murdered my home world. I murdered all kinds of things, and I don't give a shit. I had my good reasons for You're it. You're a fucking pervert. You're a sicko. I'm not a pervert or a sicko. I'm a hopeless romantic is what I am. We're gonna murder you is what you are. Unlikely. I've saved my best Glorcon clones to protect me here in my inner sanctum. Glorcon clones, attack! Oh shit! We gotta Fuck kill you. him! Come on, partner! I knew I was in love. I couldn't stop obsessing about that path, but the future. I knew the only way that it could come into existence is if I manifested it by breaking free from the abstainers, merging worlds, bringing life to my true love of my giant, 12 butthole, seven vagina, beautiful flesh beast of love. You're fucking gross, man! Something's wrong with you! You destroyed both of our whole world! You fucking fucked it all up by destroying the merged planet. Now I have to find other planets and merge them together. It's gonna cost my true love at least two buttholes. That's fine, my true love will be a little bit different. But at least my true love will still have all those diamond heart penises. All 18 of them. Diamond heart, rock hard penises, always hard, never get soft, actual bones inside of them. That's why I'm merging these worlds in the specific way that I am, because once these worlds are merged, and those worlds are merged, then I'm gonna get some life from those worlds, and cross-pollinate it with life from these worlds, and then merge a couple of more worlds, and before you know it, one, two, three, my true love is here, and my true love is ready to go, ready to support me, ready to care about me, ready to love me, in a wholesome and comforting way that I've never felt. And also, those 18 rock-hard penises and 13 vaginas, who's gonna turn their nose up at that? Fuck! What the fuck? Why are the, why are the pylon shields off? Glorcon clones! What's going on? Glorcon, we don't know. We're working on it. We, we, we're not sure what happened. There's been some sort of electrical surge. We'll fix it, you fucking dum-dums! 
Now's our chance, partner! Now's our chance! Don't let him get in! <laughs> God damn it, you fucking put gore goddamn clones! What the fuck? We gotta up our game! Oh shit, partner! We're getting to him! We're getting to him! Come on! Fucking idiots. This is this 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 chamber is so much more difficult than the first chamber. This is my fallback safety chamber in case of emergency. Uh, you. And now you're fucked because I've got extra more difficult Glorcon clones. And there's no fucking way you're gonna be able to take out my pylons that power my fucking protective shield that protects me. And you're fucking dead. Now, I'd like to talk a little bit more about my one true love. Partner, there's gotta be a way to do this. I swear to God, I, I, I have a feeling it's sort of building on what we just did in that last room. There's gotta be another one or two of those fucking power orbs in here. Fuck you, you little shitbags. There's no fucking power orbs. And Lorcon Clones, I swear to God, if anyone accidentally drops a power orb in here, I will have you personally executed. Keep the power orbs in the power orb section of the castle. You understand? You understand, Lorcon, no power orbs will be entered into this part of the, of the castle right now. Uh, we have our best clones currently moving the power orbs into another section of the castle. Oh, shit! I, I hit the wrong lever! There goes another orb! God damn it, you fucking idiots! Fucking Lorcon clones! I imbued you with super intelligence! What is going on here? Fuck! Listen, Trover, cheer up me and don't fucking touch that goddamn orb. Lorcon clones, protect that power orb. Don't let him fuck with it. Kill Trover. Kill the Cherorpian. But Trover first, that's important. Since you guys are here and you're about to die, there's no reason for me to be all angry. I mean, I'm about to get what I want, so I'm gonna I'm gonna just talk to you like I would talk to some why do you idiots keep dropping these orbs into the pipes? Keep dropping the orbs? You got it, boss. Turn the pipes off! Don't use them at all! Why do we even have this system? I'm really sorry, uh, Glorcon. I, I deeply apologize. I don't know what happened there. Shut the fuck up, you fucking idiots. Uh, I'm... I'm just gonna clear my head behind my protective shield. I'm safe. We're gonna kill these idiots. This is absurd that we even let them come this far. I just want to think about my one true love. That kind of centers me. Oh, my one true love. What we will do together. We're going to go to the beach. A crazy alien beach resort. They're going to have a giant blanket. I'm going to make sure of it. Giant terry cloth towel. We're going to lay it on the beach. We'll back the truck up and unload my one true love. Make sure the truck is nice and greased up so my one true love slips right out as the truck lifts up and dumps my one true love onto the massive terry cloth towel that'll be on the beach. And then that's when we'll order our drinks. We'll cheers them. And we'll have a giant umbrella, beach umbrella. And, and we'll just talk about the future. How many kids do you want to have? Oh, I don't know. How many kids do you want to have? Is the sand bothering you right now, babe? Yes, it is, sweetie. I'll lick it off of you. And then I'll lick the sand off. Oh, God, it's actually everywhere. But why does it taste like sugar? Why does it taste so delicious? And why am I swallowing it all? Because we're on the beaches of Glucosius with the sugariest sand of any world. And by the way, guess where that world came from? Me. I created it by merging a bunch of worlds together. You fucking idiots. You think your piddly little fucking shit is more important than my fucking future that I'm creating? Kill these fucking cocksuckers! Kill these fucking assholes! Kill these pieces of shit! Oh yeah, I never thought I'd be this calm watching the two of- Whoa, 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 what the fuck? What the fuck? God damn it! My highest- No! You've gotta be fucking kidding me! Fucking Glorcon clones! Up your fucking game! Shit, 
<laughs> now you're really fucked. This is my most treacherous chamber of all. Partner, we gotta lay into Glorcon. Now's our chance. We gotta hit him. We gotta hit him. Oh, Partner, try to get your dogs. Ugh, dead pets. Fuck! God damn it! Fuck! No! No! Shit! Partner, we're doing it! We're doing it, partner! Oh, oh, oh. Uh, uh, partner, uh, try to grab one! No! No! You gotta be fucking kidding me! God damn it, you weren't supposed to get this far! Toughest Glorcon clones I've ever made! I saved them for this room! Their hit points are out of control! It's fucking crazy! The level of difficulty is wild in here! With these Glorcon clones in your fuck! Oh, my one true love, please! I will, I will, I will, I will see you in the future! I will, I will! Fucking Glorcon clones! Up your fucking game! I can't believe how stupid you guys are coming in here trying to kill me. It just makes me chuckle. My precious Glorcon clones are gonna come after your fucking ass and rip you to shreds. What the fuck? No more orbs! Ugh, That's it! Enough with this fucking Glorcon clone incompetence! You're all dead! If I see a fucking Glorcon clone into this room, I will fucking personally kill them myself! As for you, purple eyehole monster, if you want something done right, you gotta do it your fucking self. <laughs> <laughs> How about that, Cherorpion? You fucking idiot! Now your little purple friend is dead! Ripped his fucking head off! Look at your partner! I want you to look at the gore that I just created! <laughs> Are you kidding me? That's like if I got shot by uh, one of those little foam dart guns. I didn't even feel that. You're dumb. You're fucking dumb and also really, really disrespectful to your dead friend. That's. Oh, ow! Fuck! God damn it! Oh, it fucking hurt! Son of a bitch, that fucking hurt! Ah! Fuck you. What was I talking about again? Ugh, fuck you. Anyway, uh, where was I? And I don't fucking need. Oh, you can't do that to me. Anyway, where was I? And I don't fucking need... Oh, he thought it would give me that easy. Anyway, listen, uh, I'm trying to tell you, um... And I don't fuck... You gotta be fucking kidding me! You fucking sociopath! You fucking use... Oh, fucking asshole. You gotta be fucking kidding me! You fucking sociopath! Fucking use your friend's decapitated head to take the shields down around my world merging machine? The fuck is the matter with you? It's fucking disgusting and sick. Okay, so listen, I'm gonna pick up where I left off. Um, and I don't fucking need. Uh, oh no, no, no! Ah uh, fuck! Ah, uh, ah! Uh, fucking abstainers! Ah, uh, god! No, no! This isn't supposed to happen. My one true love. No, all the dicks and buttholes. Oh, oh! <laughs> On tonight's broadcast, love, happiness, and euphoria. Chills of absolute pure bliss running down your body. That's on tonight's forecast for today. You're watching the All The Time channel. This is the All The Time show. Oh, ah, uh, you feel that euphoric feeling? Oh, ah, uh, we're all united. We're all connected. We're all one. Mm, uh, man, ah, uh, oh, ah, uh, 
Oh, man, I'm feeling it all up and down my little baby spine. Oh, 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 oh. all right. We're going to go to test pattern for a little bit. Because I got to, listen, who cares, you know? Everything's cool. We're going to go to test pattern. We'll come back in a little bit. Message one. It's me! It's Trover! Oh my god! You have no idea what's going on! I mean, holy crap! I f I, let me tell you something. I feel like a gazillion bucks right now. My whole body is all tingly. I feel all euphoric and... Oh god, you feel that? There's your little pup-pup guys. You're reunited with them. They love you. We're all together, man. Here, I'll let the boss tell you. He's right outside. Come on! Scorpion, come out here. I'm gonna tell you a little something-something. I'm cool. I'm cool. I got my shit together. I want to tell you something. Oh. Oh. Oh, God. I feel euphoric. Oh, Jesus Christ. Everything's euphoric, partner. Come on. Trover. Oh, Cherorpian. Oh, my God. I feel so good. Everyone's dead. The entire universe. The, the whole cosmos. Have this one away. Killed everyone. But it's great because everyone's here. Everyone. One's happy. This, this place, it, it just feels good to be here. Everyone's united. We're all on the same page. There's no more fighting or any trouble. And it's and we're all in this weird afterlife world. And we're 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 united together. And it's wonderful. Come, come when you get a second. Come out here and come say hi. Come out into this cloudy wonderland. Here, it's great. Uh, oh, oh, I love it here. Oh, what a great ending. Oh, this is the best ending of any video game oh, I've ever seen. Oh, oh, there's never been a better ending. <laughs> oh, you're taking off? Okay, I'll I can't be, believe I'll be how right beautiful here. this place oh. is. Oh, oh, oh. You see how beautiful it is? Oh, man. Oh, I'm lucky I got here a little bit before you. Oh. oh, hey, it's you too. Remember me? You killed me at the beginning? I was the first person here. Thanks to you, I made it just in time for the Afterlife Early Bird Special. Two eggs, two strips of bacon, toast, and an over-the-pants hand job by a blind milkman. To be honest, the eggs were a little cold, and the beef the time feels like it's been rubbing up against an awful carpet for the better part of the day, but who cares? I just fucking love it here. It's so awesome, and it's boric and nice, and oh, I'm just gonna shit right here. Ah! <sighs> <sighs> How's it going, you guys? Oh, I feel like such a bonehead. I am so dumb. I can't even, I can't believe what I was up to. Oh, boy, you know, being killed and elevated to this incredible afterlife world where I'm sh I shed all of my earthly... Goodbye, guys. Oh, man, this afterlife world. Oh, oh God, it feels so good, you know? Oh. you guys oh man let me tell you something i am so clear-headed and happy in this oh, crazy I wonder if Mrs. World. Was i here. can't even tell you about it you know what's ironic is you should have killed those villagers and because they, they would have been brought here to this amazing afterlife world this place is so good i am just in love with this place everyone i know is here you guys are here you're great i love everybody i feel a sense of overwhelming sense of euphoria and happiness here I mean, goodness gracious, and I think we get to live here for eternity. I don't know how it works, still trying to figure it out, but it is something else. Oh. Man, I feel good here. Love it. Oh, yeah. This seems like where Mrs. Poptons would hide a green power baby. These green power babies, they don't hide themselves. Hey, 
it's you two. I am so happy I'm here instead of in my house without the basketball above the garage, you know, that hoop deal. I was just starting to wish I had a basketball hoop above my garage again, and then, wham! Now I'm here, and this place is great. I don't even feel like I need a garage, or a basketball hoop, or even a house. I don't need any. Oh, 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 my brother, you two are the best, love you. Trover. Oh, hey, what's up, Gail? Listen, Trover, I, I need to tell you, I feel like a real piece of shit now that I'm feeling all this euphoria just stroking my body up and down. Like if, if my, if, as if for my body were a giant penis or labia. I don't care that you left me hanging with last month's rent and $720, including the cleaning deposit, and I don't care that you stole my crystal baby. You know what? And killed I bet my an roommate. elephant hit hey, this Gail. one. I don't care that you knowingly fucked Shrinkle when you thought it was a decal, and I don't care that you peed in the sink on purpose. All right, Gail. And I don't care that you never have. Worn a hat, and I bet I lost all in this one. upsetness about that you shit in my mouth when I slept. And I don't, I'm not even I upset or worried Boo. that you don't close Hit the shower one. curtain while you showered. And I don't care that I walked in on you while you were jerking off to Judge Brown Crinkle. What? Get my favorite Yell, show, what? Guilty Pledge. Oh, see you guys later. Man, I can't. This is this is amazing. Like this is. I feel whole and complete too. Now that they mention it, I feel a little high. Like I'm on some sort of drug. That the big. Oh, hey guys, might... how's it going? Comedy guy. Hey, you know we tried to see your show the other night, but, but instead you walked in on a murder scene. Murder? But uh, we thought you killed yourself. Yeah, and so did the police. It was foul play, Trover, that involved insider trading, drug trafficking. Wet hobo oatmeal disco fights. Five old Asian senators peeing in a baby pool. Laundering couch change. Murder. A dairy farmer feeding a pickle to a blind dog. And the list goes on. Oh my god! But this one smells here, a little funny. You must have been here for a while. I've sold out crowds every night with zero hecklers. But you know what the best. Oh, oh hey, you're you even here. Oh, boy, shit tough crowds. <laughs> Pissy shit piss. And poop and poo poo and pee and brown bad poop and yellow piss and shit. Poo poo pee. I want all the poop. Oh, you're taking off. Okay, oh, bye. Oh, hey, look who it is. Oh, my God, just the two people we were looking for. We have a question to ask you two, but before we do, I that just want to say thank you. Funny. Thank you been there for, a for while. pushing me and a dozen living lunch boxes off of a cliff. That lucky son of a gun, Michael, who I've always loved, got here before me. We just love it here. It's the best. And it turns out you can have sex with just about anything and it'll get pregnant, which means Mr. Pop-Up and I are having a baby. We had sex. That's right, we had sex in every imaginable position that you could think of. We're just so excited and happy to become parents. Oh, and this place All right, this is what feels I'm talking so about, nice man. Thank you. Oh, okay, you're leaving? Man, you know, okay, part of me ya. feels like this is too good to be true. You know, there's got to be some kind of weird something's up. You know, it's like this is too crazy to feel this good. Oh, hey, what's going on? Hey, hey, Chair Orpian. What's up, uh, 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 purple guy? Hey, listen, man, we feel really good. We're really sorry. Yeah, we're the clones that were up on the wall. On that one level that we're giving you giving you trouble. Yeah, the, the, the level with the cold. Oh, all right, see you guys. Oh, welcome back. Where were we? Oh, I know. We're just so excited and happy. Okay, bye. Oh, hey, look who it is. The two people that I love most. I was just talking about how... That's just the wet TV now. So anyways, I was just talking about how you two killed me. Thank you so much for sending me to this. It's waterproof now, I guess. Okay, cool. So, thank you so much for sending me to this incredible place. 
I love it, and I love you. I love both of you so very much. I want to make love to you both. All right, well, you guys got to go. Grubby, I'll see you grub, later. grub, 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 grub. Hurry up and feed me. Oh, I want a worm. Feed me a worm. I want a little grub worm, and I want it now. It's coming out of the ground. Did you see him? He's right there. so long. Why are you doing this with your life? What are you doing with your life? Grubworm! It's called Grubworm. G-R-U-B, not Fuckworm. Have you ever heard of a human fountain before? It's when you lay down on your back while fully erect and pee directly in your mouth. It never stops because you're drinking it. <laughs> Get this over with. I want grubby grubbles. Oh, hey, Mr. Mubster, give me some grubster and see what I will do. I'll eat that little thing right away and then I'll blow a kiss to you. I'm never gonna stop asking, never, never, until you feed me. Hey, I'm Tony. Man, I like it here. It's awesome up here. You guys are the best. This place is amazing. I feel like I'm coming. I'm with my brother now. We're reunited. Me and Downgrade Donnie together again. This afterlife zone is so awesome. It feels great to be with my bros and my sis. This place is like the fucking best. It's like having a boner and pooping at the same time, like kind of like a blumpkin. It's fucking amazing. And everyone's here, like Tony's here, and Teddy, and Donnie, and even Schweppy's here. I mean, can you believe that? Get out of here. Oh, hey. Did you ever meet him? He gives you the sticky chair upgrade. Ah, mm, ah, I make everything sticky. I haven't seen Schweppy in forever. Well, anyway, we just love it up here. Everything feels so good and euphoric. It just feels so nice. Like, ugh. Oh, get down. Oh, get down. Get down. Oh, hey, look. Cherubian, partner. It's, 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 we got a telepod. There's a telepod here. Holy crap. Partner, seriously, listen. If we go back to the levels we didn't collect all the power babies in, all right, you collected all the green power babies and we are ready to give you your big reward. So here we go. Oh, whoa, whoa, wait a second. Oh shit. You know, we, 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 we said that this game's best played with the with the gamepad that has rumble feature in it. I, we made that pretty clear up front. This isn't gonna quite work the way that, that we had hoped. Um, all right, you know, all right, go get a controller, a gamepad that's got rumble. I know you got one laying around and uh, go ahead and get that, go ahead and get that and then make sure rumble's turned on, get that rumble turned on and then hit this button and you are gonna be blown away. So go get your controller and plug it in and then hit this button and make sure rumble's turned on because then you can take the controller and shove it all the way up your ass. <laughs> Partner, seriously, listen, if we go back to the levels we didn't collect all the power babies in and get the rest of the ones we didn't get, yeah, sure, we have to re-experience the level exactly as it was experienced before. And yeah, sure, it was a big fucking bunch of bullshit, but we will get a chance to collect all the green power babies, and there's all these amazing unlocks that it gives us. I mean, all kinds of crazy ass shit we unlock. A whole bunch of shit. I mean, come on, let's do it.